sound right, boys. Hello, hello. Happy Sunday to everybody. Hopefully you've had a good weekend. For those of you that uh, actually watched college football yesterday, hopefully uh, your team won or you enjoyed watching somebody else's team lose. <laughs> um, you see me looking over there a lot during stream. I have a uh, Cardinals-Pirates baseball game on, so uh, I'm watching the game. Let's get some sound in here because I always turn that down. There we go. All right, let's do a little bit of a review here. So we have. Uh, Four years in the books. Um, started as a, let's do it this way. Started as a 63 overall team, and we got the uh, 22nd overall recruiting class in year one. Uh, that jumped us up to a 74 overall. And then the second year, we got the number one recruiting class. And that jumped us up to a 79 overall. Um, we got the number four recruiting class that year. So last season we jumped up to an 86 overall. Um, and we made our first bowl game, but we ended up going six and seven, which was a disappointment. We should have won with an 86 overall team. We should have won the conference. <clears throat> we, got, <clears throat> we got the number 13 recruiting class last season. So um, that's mostly because we didn't... Uh, we didn't go after a huge recruiting class because we only had five seniors. So we have a very, very young team. Um, as you can see here, we uh, we only have we have seventeen. We only have nine seniors this year and seventeen juniors. So we're going to try to uh, even that out just a little bit. Maybe make it. Uh, uh, I've got us down with 15 recruits. We've got a bunch of juniors and I'm sorry, freshmen and sophomores coming up. So we'll have to uh, balance that out next year. But we're we're going for like 15. That's our goals around 15 every season, 15 to 17. So so that just means we would cut some of these uh, like the 68s and 69s and low 70s that are in the uh, previous classes. So anyway, so this is what our uh, recruiting targets are. Sean, oh hey, welcome in, man. Doing good. How are you? Been uh, chomping at the bit to get this started. I woke up at like six thirty and had to basically kill five and a half hours. Spectre, welcome in. Been watching uh, Kill the Tribe and play this strange. Um game that you found on PlayStation Network so that was interesting <clears throat> New York City and we're back to Philly that shouldn't be that that long of a trip I had a, a uncle that used to live in Philadelphia um, and he worked in New York and in Philly Dropkick Murphy awesome that's pretty cool hopefully that was a fun look at killed raiding with a party of six welcome in Q I appreciate that yeah, I would have stuck around for more of that game, but uh, you were getting frustrated with it, and I had to get my own started, so. 
Welcome in, welcome in. We're just going through uh, the needs for my uh, team for this year to get our recruiting set up. So since I have a junior fullback, we need a, uh, a freshman to come in in red shirt for next year. Um, need a couple of uh, wide receivers, need another tight end because we have a senior graduating. Two tackles, two guards, two DNs, a D tackle. One outside, one middle, and two corners. So, not a huge class, so we should be able to get all of that. And those of you that uh, haven't seen me before, we uh, I have a broken wrist right now. I had a car accident, so I can't play the games. Um, so we are uh, just simming games for the moment until I find out uh, when this cast can come off. So, we are... Uh, we are uh, just messing around with Northern Colorado, which is uh, like an hour north of Denver and an hour south of Cheyenne, Wyoming. That's where I went to college. So we are in year five. So hopefully uh, if you like football, you'll enjoy this. If not, then maybe you'll just uh, stick around and chat. Um, this is our schedule. So the ones with the uh, red padlock, those are conference games that we have no choice over. Um, we are going to play NC State late. Jimmy, Jimmy, welcome in, man. Thanks for the sub. We'll play NC State. I always like to get an open week if all possible in week eight. Um, we're going to play Ball State. Uh, Central Florida, which is another uh, team that I stream with. I'm currently on hiatus until I can learn how to uh, play with this cast on, which isn't going to be good. Uh, we're going to play East Carolina. This is a rematch of our bowl game. We lost to them, um, I think, by three points, wasn't it? Um, in our last stream, so we're gonna get a we're gonna get a uh, rematch right away. Eagles, welcome in. Hello, hello. Get this camera straight. Crooked or my straight? There we go. So that's our schedule. Nothing special. Nothing too difficult. Um, we need to get um, need to get a conference championship. Get a better bowl game. I'm in the last year. Check this out. I'm in the last year of my contract. They did not extend me last year. I still haven't hit seven wins. Now they're telling me I need to get eight wins this year or they're not bringing me back. So uh, we should be able to get eight wins for sure. So I don't know what the overall is on this team yet. I can't look until we get into the season, but it should be in the low 90s. Um, let's go back one, one second. Let's go back to the screen. So you can see we have a lot of young, good young quarterbacks, good young running backs. Got a bunch of young wide receivers there, young develop, same thing at tight end. Need to work on some uh, younger offensive linemen. We got a lot of juniors and seniors that are gonna be leaving soon, so we need to replace all of that. Um, D tackle, we're pretty good. D end, we need to uh, build some depth. Middle linebacker, we just need one more. Corners are fine. We just got to replace the guys graduating. So our uh, our team is set. We should be able to uh, win this conference this year and compete for a decent bowl game. So let's hope that actually works. So um, I did go in here and fill out my board the other night. So we're just going to go uh, scout all these guys, and you can see. Yay, thank you for the biddies. Appreciate that. Outcast Gaming, welcome in, welcome in. Hey, no problem. Appreciate the lurk, man. I, I do the same thing as well, so whenever you get done and uh, can jump in, please do. And as I said earlier, if you see me looking over here off, off camera frequently, I have the Cardinals and Pirates baseball game on, so I'm kind of keeping an eye on that too. So let's go through the positions. Um, I don't need a quarterback. I don't need a running back. I do need a fullback. So we put two guys on the board. Um, we're first on one and third on the other. So hopefully we get one of those. We need uh, two wide receivers. And these guys are kind of placeholders right now unless we find some really good ones in uh, low lock, which will be in uh, week two. Um, tackle, we need two tackles. Hopefully this guy will uh, want to come play for us. Uh, 
definitely want to upgrade these two. Hopefully they'll uh, they'll be gems when I scout them. Um, need a couple of guards. We'll probably have to add more guards to the list here. Um, need two DNs. I only found one worth of crap, so we'll have to uh, find one in week two. Probably two guys in week two. Um, same thing with outside linebackers. We need need one of outside, one middle. We need to add more to the list though. Uh, corners, we need two, so hopefully we can find some more guys. Um, get those upgraded. Um, and we have to add more guys to the board. I've only got 17 on the board. So uh, let's jump in here and look real quick and see if we can find some more guys. And I'm going to uh, go up here to the caliber and make that a three star so we're not looking at any, any uh, one and two stars. I don't want to look at any JUCOs or any of that garbage. So I've already got enough fullbacks, so let's go take a look at some of these wide receivers. Um, sort by 40 time, and now we're just going to look by pitch info, which is our bonuses, and try and find some guys that uh, we might have a chance at with decent bonus, like this guy. not mean to do that. Give me one second. <laughs> I just meant to uh, back out of him, not all the way out. All right, let's try this again. All right, pitch info. Let's find some good. We're looking for green letters. High overalls and green letters like this guy. Aaron Martin, throw him on the board. Patrick Wright, I'll throw him on. He should get some sort of uh, bump up in the overall. Tight end, we'll sort tight end by squat. Might not be too bad. This guy's a 64. He's so slow. I'll put him on there anyway, just in case. There's a 75. We'll throw him on there. All right, so let's go. Looking for a lot of green on these guys. Um, I don't like wide receivers that run uh, four fives. I'm looking guys below four five. If he has really good catching, then you can kind of um, take the four fives and put them in the slot. But I typically just sort by 40 times and go anybody under a four five. This guy's a Juco. We don't Really want three star. Yeah, he's not bad. I'm, I really prefer the three stars on the offensive line right now because they're not as heavily recruited as the uh, four star guys. So it's a little bit easier to land them. Throw him on. What else do we need? We need defensive ends and defensive tackles. So. throw him on there and I did take uh, an actual pain pill today I've been putting it off I've only taken one um, since I've been home from uh, vacation but uh, it's been bothering me a little bit so hopefully it'll uh, bother me a little less during stream usually what happens is it hurts like hell after I'm done streaming so <laughs> let's try to uh, not stream for six hours today and uh, see if we can uh, not be in pain when we get done. Um, I started a, uh, a separate off stream dynasty last night just to test out coach mode because I've never really used coach mode. Uh, Jimmy was talking about, uh, Jimmy Tubelance was talking about wanting to play coach mode, so uh, we. Uh, I went in there because I haven't played it very much. Um, let's go to corner. 
Um, so I was playing with it, so there's a pretty good chance we will do some coach mode um, with this particular dynasty today, where I'll uh, go in and I'll, uh, I can do fast sim, but I can also go in and, and call the plays, and uh, that'll be our last guy. And that way, we, we still don't have control over the players, but we do have control over what plays we call and how, when we can call timeout. 63 overall, D end, decent finesse power, but okay. Um, Eagles, his, uh, I, I only look at squat and bench, and then speed last, especially for D tackle. So mine is uh, 600 squat, and 400 bench is what I'm looking for. Um, if they hit the 600 and 400, then I know that overall is going to go up. If they don't hit 600 and 400, they may or may not go up. How they may go down. So, all right. So all those guys we just added, I know we're not on their board. So I'm not going to move them around right now. We're going to scout the first 20 guys, and then we'll move guys around. So let's scout these guys. 86 pass block. Definitely need that. Seven corner with 92 speed is good. 70, he's not bad. 96 cell, I like that. He can uh, he can get red shirted and go uh, practice and get better. 66 fullback. I don't really use fullbacks. It really doesn't matter, so I don't care that he's uh, that uh, he's not a gem. In fact, he's the opposite of a gem. He went down seven, but I don't really care. We're playing uh, air raid. There you go. That's what you need. 690 squad is really good. Alright, that wide receiver is not great. So he's going away. We'll go find another wide receiver before we move on to the next week. Alright, so he went up 5. He's a gem. Sixty-seven. He's not bad. Ninety-one speed. He's about the bottom range we're gonna go. We don't, we don't like anybody below sixty-seven. All these offensive linemen are basically uh, just uh, depth guys at this point. All right. 56 catch with 92 speed, you're gone. So we got to go find two more guys, two more wide receivers. So we're done. We have no more points, right? So uh, let's go find some more wide receivers that actually have. Uh, and I'm, I'm actually, I'm going to go and let me fix this. I got to change the caliber. We're also going to look at uh, athletes. In fact, I think I'm going to look at athletes first try and find somebody that can play wide receiver and possibly corner so again sort by 40 which is automatically on here by 40 so now we're gonna look at pitch which is your bonus we're looking for a lot of green guys a lot of green especially the first one yeah that D in the second spots not too good this one isn't too bad I threw him on the board but I didn't look at him what is he He's a running back. I don't need a running back. The catch. Throughout running and release aren't good. I'm going to take him off the board. I don't need a running back. Okay, I got good man. Zone, press. But he's not a good, uh, not a good bonus. We need, we need bonus points to help us out here. Come on. All right, all of his catching is in the C's. That's good. He's got A acceleration. So Kenneth Washington probably won't get him, but we'll throw him on the board anyway. Oh, here's this going already. This guy's a decent DB. Looking for a better. Still want the wide receiver.
Catching traffic's not too good. 446, he's a Juco, that's why. 79, this guy's a good receiver. Real good receiver. Looks like he can play a running back too, almost. Yeah, 103 spark. We'll throw him on there, what the hell. If uh, if no one puts any interest into him, then that, that'll be a, a really good find, but chances are we're probably gonna get uh, shut down on him pretty early, but that's okay. Slice bread, hey man, thank you for the follow, appreciate that, welcome in. Those of you that are new, if you want to jump in chat and one, you can tell me uh, tell me where you found me and uh, um, do you stream? If you do stream, what do you stream? And uh, if you like uh, college football, you can tell me who your favorite teams are, your least favorite teams are, any of that good stuff so we can uh, get a little information on you. One sec here, I'm going to uh, sort this top list since we've already scouted them. This will save us time later. So we'll have two separate boards. We'll have the top board of guys that were scouted and the bottom guys of guys who were not scouted. Six. Let's see. Making sure I get all the guys that have already been scouted so I can push them up the board. Zero. Seventy nine we got. We're almost done. Then we'll uh, move on to the next week. Finish scouting these guys. See where we stand. Offer everybody. Um, get into uh, get into week two and see what we have to do. Because some of these guys are going to get dumped off the board because we're we're going to fall way behind because the schools that have bigger bonuses are going to jump all over them and some of them will be instant commits. You know how that all works. I haven't seen any really weird names. You know, last year we had Parker Parks on here, so I haven't haven't noticed anybody that was uh, silly, stupid name. Let's go. I did have a guy uh, in a different uh, dynasty who just had a last name. He had no first name. Can't remember what it was. But uh, yeah, he was he was a prince wannabe. He's just going to go by one name, and that's it. It's pretty funny. He was a wide receiver. Almost done. Let's get this guy up here. All right. Let me check our bonuses here real quick. You can see we're uh, kind of in limbo because we haven't gotten enough wins. We should be littered with A's and B's right now, but our wins have come really slow at this point. So um, we've got some work to do. I'm hoping this year we'll in improve all of that. Um, this team should be in the uh, low 90s. As you can see, um, we have no needs. And in fact, if you look at the second column here, the rating column, um, on defense, middle linebacker, free safety, and corner, I'm sorry, middle linebacker, free safety, and strong safety are the only ones that aren't B's. On offense, fullbacks, tight ends, guards, and centers are not Bs that don't care about fullbacks and tight ends because we don't use them necessarily a lot. But the guards and centers definitely need to get improved. So, all right, let's exit out of here and uh, start the season. One sec, I gotta turn my fan around because it's getting warm in here already. With that uh, hurricane hitting uh, Louisiana, we're going to get doused with a bunch of rain days here coming up, at least Monday and Tuesday, so that'll drop the uh, 
the temp. It's been like in the uh, mid to high 90s all week and very humid. So I'm actually looking forward to fall. I'd look forward to it even more if I could get outside and work out, but I am, who knows how long that's gonna be with this wrist. Hey Ropes, say hey, welcome in, man. <clears throat> we uh, just started like 26 minutes ago, so we went over the uh, initial board that I put together, which was only like 17 players, and we went and found some more guys to put on the board. So, uh, um, so right now we're uh, trying to get everybody. Uh, oh, look at that! We had 12 preseason all conference. That's good. That helped my coach. Yeah, I've played as Oregon before. I like playing as Oregon. All right. Let's get in here and finish our scouting. And then we, uh, since I still don't have Insta Commit, we're going to offer everybody and give the remaining points to uh, guys we really want. So let's get in here and finish this scouting. Eighty one. Look at that. Eighty eight speed, eighty catch, eighty six route, eighty catch in traffic, seventy nine spec catch, seventy nine release. And then you go to the bottom, seventy five break tackle, seventy five stiff arm, seventy nine carry, eighty five elusive, eighty seven juke, seventy eight spin. He's also got eighty nine throw power, eighty one. This guy can play quarterback, wide receiver, and halfback. We probably have no chance to get this guy whatsoever. But that guy can play everywhere. He would be a game changer, man. He is ridiculous. All right. So we could play him at wherever we wanted because we're we're plenty deep at quarterback. Do not need him at quarterback at all. A lot of these guys at the bottom that we didn't scout, um, probably not going to get them. I don't think we're on any of their boards, and they're pretty high overalls, but I just grabbed guys we had good bonuses with um, so that if no one is... Uh, scouting them or putting them on their board early we can get a head start on some really good players got another gym there we go go like that all right so now let's move these guys up the board join them with the rest of the board so we can see where we stand at each position I know I can reorder this by overall, but it does not. When you do that, um, you lose some of the uh, ability to look at everything on one screen. So I know uh, some people like to uh, sort by points ahead or points behind. But when you do that, it puts that number in the same place where their overall is. And so then you lose what their overall is. You have no idea what they are. Are they a 79? Are they a 65? So I just like to uh, take the time to put this board in order for my own uh, preference and then we'll get on. Are you playing the game or are you uh, simming the game ropes? Because if you're simming the game that's good. If you're playing the game then that's kind of expected just based on uh, being able to call the plays and knowing um, if you want to uh, hand the ball off or not. Yeah, actually playing. Yeah. Playbook helps in that situation. Um, I might have to go look at some other uh, plays to run because uh, I'm kind of getting bored with my own spread playbook. Um, that's one reason why I'm I'm playing with the Air Raid right now in this particular one to uh, try something different. When I was testing the... Uh, Coach mode last night and this morning, I picked uh, Middle Tennessee State because they're an air raid school to begin with. So their roster was already set up for air raid. And uh, I just wanted to see how it would play if I call the plays for them. So it wasn't bad. We won seven games, but we didn't get a bowl. Can you believe that? How can you go seven and five and not get a bowl game? I don't understand how that works. I thought if you got... I know you're bowl eligible at six, but I thought if you got seven, you had a bowl for sure, and we, we kind of got screwed. Al 
Sean Allen. Yeah, I've seen a lot of those guys with double names like that. I've seen them in Madden too. It's just an EA glitch. All right, we're almost done. I was I was rather shocked. Couldn't believe we didn't get a bowl. We lost our last game against UTEP, so had we won that, we would have gotten one for sure. <clears throat> you streaming Madden 22? Because I'm not playing Madden 22. I'm not playing Madden at all. Yeah, yeah, I've seen that. I, I follow a lot of people on uh, Twitter and uh, YouTube, so I've seen all the glitchy stuff. Alright, so now since we don't have who did I not scout? Wow. Went up eight at tight end. Holy shit. Give me a sec while I push him up the board. That was a nice find. So now we're just going to offer everybody, so give me a second while we, uh, we spam the X button here. Ben Bobo. Yeah, that's a funny name too. I wish there was a way you could just offer everybody instead of hitting spamming this button. Yeah, I'm on, I'm on Madden uh, Reddit, um, NCAA Reddit. Super Mega Baseball, City Skylines, um, Cyberpunk, a bunch of others, but they also have a problem with the uh, fatigue um, in that game. You know how they, they have the progressive fatigue, so if you over uh, practice with a guy, then he gets tired and, and uh, he doesn't have uh, full stamina. Well, as you do that and get later into the season, your player will either play one down or no downs, and then he won't be able to be put um, on the depth chart. He won't he won't show up at all. He's just gone for the entire game. So somebody was complaining about that on Reddit, and I was just like, just turn it off. Turn off that shit until they get it fixed, because it's obviously broken. All right. I'm going to do this a little bit different. Let's look at fullbacks. So, we're not number one. We are number one here. I'm not going to put the points on this guy. Um, and I'm only going to put 100 on this guy because we already offered him. I don't want to waste extra points. And I'm not too uh, worried about getting high, high overalls. Yeah, they're gone. Spectre, they, they don't show up at all. You'll be playing games late in the season trying to get in the playoffs. And um, they're gone. It's off for 150, these two guys. I'm not going to put a lot of points on the top guys because we're way behind. And I only put them on the board just in case um, no one is interested. We're going to give this guy 200, though. All right, so we need two tackles and two guards. We're number one on his board, so I'm going to go ahead and throw 200 on him. $250. And let's take a chance with Anthony Hall. We'll give him 200 We need to really improve our offensive line talent, the depth. So probably have no chance on those two guys. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do something a little different. Give 150 for each one of these for each of these two guys, and uh, I'll come back and throw more points on one of these guys once I see how many points we have left over because we're getting a little light. It's defensive ends. Just need one outside, one middle. I really want to throw 200 on this guy. 
Let's just throw it on this guy instead, and I'll take it away from the top one because there's probably no chance we're getting any of these 80 overalls unless no one has points on them. So that's the only reason why I put them on there. <laughs> yeah, I haven't. I've refrained from buying um, a PS5. I don't really want to get one right now. I'm perfectly fine playing on what I have, but if uh, if they make the new uh, college football game next gen. Um, then I may not have a choice. Not really looking forward to doing that to drop, you know, 500, 500 bucks just to play a video game. 500 plus, probably closer to 600 after you buy the game. All right, these athletes, what do we have left? We have 1,800 points. Probably not getting either one of those two guys. So let's go back up to defensive end, right? I'm going to give every one of these guys 100 points for now, and then we'll look at other positions, and then I may come back and throw more points on some of these guys. Yeah, I've never played on Xbox ever. My uh, my, my two sons um, split an Xbox. Um, let's give this guy 150. And now they're both out of the house, or... One's married and one's engaged, so they have their own stuff to play. My younger son always uh, calls and texts me frequently to tell me about his uh, road to the show, guys. Normally throw 200 on a bunch, but we're, we're trying to spread this out a little bit more. Yeah, we've only played head-to-head -head once, um, and he hit a home run on the first pitch I threw, and then I got back at him. Um, we tied. I tied the game up and went back and forth, back and forth. Um, I know how to pitch. He used to pitch. He pitched in college, D D three, um, but I also uh, helped train him, and so. We both know how to work the zone up, down, in and out, high, low. Um, so I shut him down after that. And then uh, he had a walk-off home run with, um, no, it wasn't a walk-off. It was, uh, he had a home run with George Brett. We were playing at Fenway and he hit one down the right field line, that short corner. Um, I was actually trying to pitch around him and not uh, challenge him because I had a first base open. But uh, he hit an, he hit a uh, high inside fastball for a three-run shot, so I lost. Hey, Noah, sorry to hear that, man. My condolences. I remember you talking about him the other day, so sorry to hear that. All right, let's go look at our overall. We're 93 overall, the 95 offense. If we don't win the conference this year, we're never going to win. Update my spreadsheet. All right, so let's look at the rest of the conference because there's, no one should be as good as we are. 84, 77, 81, 75, 84. 79, 83, 83, 81, 83, 79. Yeah, Rubs, I'm going to do coach mode. So what I'm going to do is when we go in and we, uh, I, I'm not going to do the fast sim where we just advance the week anymore. If I, when I do the fast sim, I'm going to put it on coach mode and then we'll just sim to the next possession. And if I want to jump in at any point, um, then I can jump in and call plays. Um, and on the uh, bigger key games that we have to win, I'll pretty much call um, 75 to 100 percent of the offensive plays, and we'll just sim defense. So I tested that out last night and this morning on a different one that I created just to test it with an air raid offense. So I'd be running the same playbook and everything. So. 
All right, let's advance this week and see what the damage is on these recruits because we're going to have to dump a bunch of guys and add a bunch of other guys back on. Yeah, I'm itching to play ropes. I'm dying to play. But if I was playing, um, we would be playing uh, Central Florida and not uh, Northern Colorado. So, Oh, I'm change something here. I've got my... Uh, Get my laptop set on a dark theme and it's not get throwing enough light on my face here. Here, hold on. There we go. Got a brand new uh, ring light, so uh, that'll help keep me from uh, sitting here in the dark. <laughs> I don't have any other lights on. I don't want to take that that towel back there that's covering up the uh, window on the door. I don't want to take that off because it'll be uh, backlit. That won't help anything. I put that towel there so that uh, the sun doesn't shine in and glare on my um, computer screen. Alright, so, wow, one of the lower guards committed. Alright, we're going to have to go back and find some more offensive linemen. Um... Whenever this comes off and I can actually play and not be in uh, excruciating pain, I get x-rays on Tuesday um, to see how it's progressing. Um, all right, let's go in here and see. It's only been a little over two weeks, like two and a half weeks since I broke it. All right, so we know we weren't gonna get this guy. So I just threw him on there in case. There's gonna be a lot of guys that we're gonna be dropping. Yep, there's another one. <sighs> All of those guys, both LSU and Miami have huge bonuses, so we're already 150 points behind LSU. Um, I might just leave them on the board with 150 and see how far behind we fall, because we'll we'll jump ahead of Georgia and Alabama, but if we're like seven, eight hundred points behind, then we can dump them next week. I might dump them now. Just depends. Bronco, hey man, welcome in, man. You have not missed much of anything. We are uh, we are in week uh, week two. We just finished setting up our board and uh, looking at all the guys that we're not going to get, and we're dumping them off the boards right now. So. I won't be shocked if we have like 10 guys left after I go through and do this. All right, so we do have a defensive tackle. Um, I'm going to max him out and hopefully try to get this, steal this guy from Oklahoma. This guy we probably have no chance of getting. We'll revisit him and Arnold. Uh, Aaron, Mar Aaron Martin, not Arnold, sorry. This guy's gone. We need one DN and one D tackle, so we may have to... Uh, Put our sights a little lower. We're going to have to do a lot of recruiting to start this one. <sighs> we have similar... I'll, I'll uh, think about this guy, but that's going to be a lot of ground to make up. A lot of points to put on him. Let's get rid of all the guys we know we have no shot on. going to be about 75% of the board. So we're the only one going up. They all offered. So let's just give him another 50 points for now. Alright, so we're only 40 points behind Nebraska. And we're, as far as our bonus goes. I'm only 20 points behind them now. So I'm going to give this guy a couple hundred points this week and see how that goes. Because if, they're, if they have uh, 500 points, then we'll drop to 120. And we know we're going to have to go higher. All right, 72 D tackle. Let's give this guy a couple hundred points. Tight end, we're good on. Corner, we're good on. Tackle, we're good. 
tackle, we're going to lose him. Wide receiver, we're good, but we only need two. Um, so that would be those two. So let's dump this guy, because that's going to be a lot of points to have to go get him. Let's give him 300 total. I think this is a waste of 300 points, but we'll try it. Give him another couple hundred points. We're just basically buying another week on those guys to see... Uh, if it's worth it or not. He's good. I have to get 100. Don't want to on a fullback, but yeah, it is what it is. Not getting him. I have to go find some more offensive linemen, that's for sure. 200's good there. Damn, they're crushing us on offensive linemen. I'm just gonna leave him where he's at as a as a uh, stopgap. Same thing with this fullback. Now let's go by position, because we need... Let's go back here, show you the depth chart. Again, one fullback, two wide receivers, one tight end, two tackles, two guards, two DNs, a D tackle, one outside, one middle, two corners. So, you got two decent fullback options there, that's good. Um, what did I say? Two wide receivers, so I need to go find one, at least one more wide receiver. At least one more guy, in case we uh, get crushed on Rivero this week. Tight end, we're in good shape. Um, two tackles, so we're going to have to go find two more tackles, three more guards. Um, let's give these guys both another 100. I don't feel confident we're going to get either one, so we're going to have to go find another uh, two DNs. These guys are fine on D-Tackle, we just need one. Outside. In middle. Looks like we're good. Marsh Madness, hey, thank you for the follow, appreciate that. So we'll probably go add a couple more linebackers just as uh, backup corners. We do need two. We have these two, so I'll go look for a couple of higher overall guys. All right, so let's go find some more players. Hey, Ropes, I, I sometimes go for it on fourth and one in my own 40. Or my own 30. I'll go for it. Let's go less than 25%. Uh. All right, let's go. Fullbacks are good, so we got to go find a couple more wide receivers. So all we're doing right here is looking for guys with no offers, which is that piece of paper with the pen on it. I think I skipped one. Nope. All right, he's good. Let's go. Four six. Nope. That's why. I, that's why I sort by forty. Don't want a four six clown in there. The tapping noise is just me pushing down on the right stick to uh, move down while I'm on this screen. Seventy. Throw him on the board. I'm not interested in. Sixty seven isn't bad. Sixty eight's not bad. All right, so let's go. Tight ends were good, so now we got to find offensive linemen, defensive line, linebacker.
All right, throw me a bone, guys. Let's go. Help me out. Somebody with no scholarship offers. Let's go. Wow, he's not good. He is not good. All right. Maybe we have some other options at guard. You can always move guards out. Killing me. Killing me on offensive linemen this year. Just killing me. All right. This guy, he's a 60 overall. He's probably going to be close to a 70, so we'll throw him on the board. And how do I know that? Because he has a 600 squat and a 400 bench. They have both of those. They're going to be gems. All right. This 66 overall. We're ahead of the one team that offered. He's not as high. Is there any centers that we can get? Because we can kick these over to guard or even tackle. Sixty-three. Not great, but we're running into a lot of a lot of uh, difficulty finding offensive linemen this year. All right, so again, low lock guys. No one has uh, any interest in. He's a sixty-two. He's not very strong. I'll throw him on the board just because, but he's not anything I'm really interested in. Same thing with this guy. Let's look at D-Tackle. There we go. Slow as shit. What it can do is move some of these outside linebackers to defensive end. Like this guy that runs a 4-8, he'd be a D-end. This guy runs a 4-9, he's another D-end. Look at all these outside linebackers. Oh, damn. 700 squat, 430 bench. Eh. Of course Notre Dame's going to get him. He's a Juco Jr. Not interested. <clears throat> Come on, boys. Throw me a bone. Let's go find some. Uh... I'm still sorting by squad on the corners. Striving, welcome in, welcome in. We're looking for low 40 times with 300 high squat. That's our tackle rating, so we'll throw him on there. Of course, Nebraska. Off the wall. Jimmy, I'm watching the Cardinal game. We're up one to nothing right now. Go one more guy. Is it you? Gun cluster formation? No, I don't get into uh, a lot of the formations. Um, there are so many different formations in the game, and sometimes it'll take away a play that I like to run in a different different thing. And uh, so I haven't messed with it too much. We're looking for more offensive linemen in this group right here, like this guy. He can play defensive end. <clears throat> All right. <sighs> Let's go scout as many as we can. I 
69 is not bad. 73. 68. 65. That's eh. 68. 67. All right, we got some definite defensive line guys that we can uh, go after. There's a 78 outside linebacker, 79. These outside linebackers that have speed in the 70s can also go play defensive line, so. There you go, 67. So all I did on that corner was sort by uh, squat. He was 300 on his squat. Um, and look for uh, 40 times in the four fours. So, his tackle ability is 70. That's much better than a lot of other corners. As you can see, this guy is 65. He's a 65. He's going away. We're going to uh, scroll through this real quick and make sure nobody has uh, up arrows on here before I offer them, like this guy. This guy we'll put points on because we have a much better um, much better bonus than the guys ahead of us, so I'm going to go ahead and offer him right now. Another guy. corner Minnesota they haven't offered so we're gonna leave them on the board I'm gonna get rid of this 65 guard um, and uh, we'll just uh, not get as many offensive linemen this year maybe we'll get them next year maybe if we win we'll get some more guys uh, interested in us so all right so we got to go back down here do the same thing I always do which is uh, put them in numerical order even at the bottom of the list because they don't always push them up to the top of the list after the uh, first week on our board. Sometimes I'll just leave them down there until I have time to pay attention. So. <clears throat> no. No, I go with athletes. Athletes are nice because they do give you flexibility on uh, multiple positions. I, uh, In fact, I have is it this one. I had one where I got a quarterback that could play a corner. Um, I think it's this team. I, I got a good quarterback, but we recruited some other quarters. And uh, so we ended up, He's. Uh, I think he's going to be the starting strong safety this year or next year because he had good cover skills, plus he was a quarterback. And we went and got a couple other uh, – um, quarterbacks and so that allowed me to move him to secondary because I didn't get somebody I didn't find somebody I wanted and so since he was flexible I was able to get him into the secondary after playing quarterback for one year all right which one of these guys do we offer because they need to go up the board Needs to go further up because we can actually put points on him if we want to. Um, there's another offensive lineman down here somewhere. At least one offensive lineman. Yeah, this corner we're probably not going to get, but that's okay. Yeah, this guy is probably, if we look at his scouting, um, he's going to show defensive skills so he's got 79 tackle, 71 hit power 81 play rack um, 
But what it doesn't show is his uh, blocking. This dude, 68 speed, he's probably a guard or a center. No ropes, I I, uh, I will recruit as many as I can get. Um, it just depends on what, what I need. I won't automatically recruit um, quarterback every year. Like this year I've already got um, a sophomore starting and two freshmen behind him. They're all redshirted already and I have one being redshirted. So I have four quarterbacks, three of them are freshmen. So I don't, uh, I don't go after anybody uh, when I have that many at a position right here. Let's go Let's give this guy a couple hundred points. Where are we at? All right, so we're 800 points back. Let's finish this bottom of the list to make sure we don't have anybody else down here that we're actually on their board and we can give points to. All right. So let's give this guy 300 points. Give him another 50. Give him the other 50. Hundred behind. Um, let's give him four hundred. All right. I know I have two empty spots. Um, I want to wait and see what we need first. I don't. I don't need twenty men. I'm only looking for fifteen guys. Um, so actually, yeah. You know what? I might. I might go look at the offensive lineman one more time problem is they have to fit what I want right so and that's 600 400 or at least high 300s on the uh, on the bench definitely no lower than like 595 on the uh, on the squat oh what a catch by Bader one more time Maybe if we find somebody that has been offered but not by the number one overall team, we can throw him on the board. Like this guy. 595. Throw him on the board. What about a guard? So we're going to uh, scout these guys. Where's the guy that I was 800 behind? Is this guy? Yeah. We'll take 200 away from him in case I want to offer as well. Are you still going to post how to use Team Builder on Revamped? Um, you can't add people on uh, Team Builder. Like, you can't go create a team. You can't do a Team Builder team, even with Revamp. Um, oh, yeah. You're talking about how to, how to get your computer so it'll let you log in online, right? Because you're still having problems logging in online with your computer. Yeah, I'll have to go, I'll have to go find that video. Um... Jimmy might remember where that was too, because that was, it might be in Jimmy or Revamp's Discord. I'll have to dig around, because there was a video you had to uh, watch. Sixty-six is trash. I don't want to offer these guys, but I don't have a whole lot of choice right now. Let's look at their top schools and see. So we still would have a shot at him. Yeah, these guys are okay. Nothing special. I hate these offensive linemen. This uh, this this group of offensive linemen is dog shit. 
I need to get some wins so some of the better offensive linemen want to come play for us. We have three, four, five, six juniors and two seniors on offensive line. So I do have an 80 overall freshman at left tackle, 78 freshman at center. Um, so we have some guys that can step in and start, but I need to I need to build some uh, some depth. New rosters out today. That's cool. They're gonna get the uh, rest of the uniforms done too. Or are they just releasing rosters? And Jimmy, do you remember where we have that uh, um, that video? Because remember, I couldn't get online to uh, get on Team Builder, and you showed me a video on how to what I had to do to get around the uh, exploit not letting me log in. Was that on your board or was that on revamps? I can't remember. Operation sports, okay. All right, there we go, boys. 93 overall, then 95 offense, 93 defense. We're actually going to put these guys in all yellow. If it will let me. It's not going to. Why won't it let me? There's the blackout. There's the chrome. Purple. I thought there was a yellow... go. We're going coach mode, Jimmy. I'm not going to play every play on offense. Um, what I'll probably do is do some fast simming within the game and see how we stand. And if we need some help, then I'll jump in and uh, start calling some offensive plays. Uh, but I'm not going to play the whole game. It'll, I don't want to take all day to play this season. These six and seven hour streams. We're an hour in right now because of recruiting taking so long. So. And it's a rain game, of course. I hate rain. There's entirely too much rain in this game. Entirely too much rain. All right, so let's sim. And we fumbled the ball. Wonderful. Touchdown, 63-yard run by our halfback, Ingram. That'll start. <laughs> That'll start us off. That will start it off good. 63-yard to the house. All right. Fumble, we got the ball back. All right, let's go watch some plays here. I'm going to call some plays. So, start off with a run. Since we're already in field goal range, let's see if we can make it second down and short. So, it, it puts the uh, green circle around my quarterback to let me know I have to snap the ball. Which is good because then we can bleed the clock how we want to bleed the clock. <coughs> All I did was unplug my controller. I had it plugged in to make sure it was uh, not going to die on me. Throw it. There we go. Up the field. First down. Keep going. There we go. There you go, Jimmy. Curls for the girls right here. Got a post in the slot and curls on the outside. Call it a gain of three yards. That makes 
So when you're on the here, let me pause this. So to do this mode, when you go in and set your uh, your um, uniform, when you're done with the uniform, you hit X. That'll take you to the page that shows your playbooks, and you use the uh, the D-pad and just go up to one. It should say regular, and if you hit like your left stick to the left, it'll say coach. If you hit it to the right, you hit have to hit it like three times. But if you hit it to the left once, it'll say coach. And this basically will let you in, and you can do fast sim. Um, but you can call plays on offense and defense. Um, you have to hike the ball on offense. Just hit X to hike the ball. Um, so the computer plays, but you pick the plays. And you can, there you go, get up the field. Score. Um, you can play offense and defense. Yep. So we have a lot more control over uh, the game right now. So we're still not playing the game. We're still simming the game, but at least we can pick the plays. As we all know, we do a better job of picking plays than the CPU does. Oh, man. Somebody's got to block him. Somebody has got to block him. All right, let's try this. I'm going to pitch it to the far side. Get out there. Get outside. Jesus. I wasn't too worried about losing yards here because it actually gives us more room to throw. Yeah, two guys in slants over here on the left side at the top of the screen. So somebody has to get open. Maybe we'll take that. Touchdown. There we go. Boom, boom, boom. 98 yards passing in the first quarter. That, that works. I can handle 400 yards a game. We're just going to sim the kick. All right, sim defense. All right, we're up two scores. Let, let's let the sim take over and see what happens. Boom, touchdown. 21 nothing. No good. Two-minute drill, let's play. Yeah. <laughs> May not be able to be UNLV. That's not good. You know, there we go. Let's do this slot drive. <sighs> this is a good running quarterback that we have. This guy's got like 90 speed, so him taking off and running isn't the bad isn't a bad thing at all. Go stick a nod for Jimmy. Snap the ball. <sighs> Fumbled. Luckily, our offensive lineman got it. Boom. Go. He's gone. Touchdown. There you go. <laughs> 248 yards in the first half. Let's try it again. Let's do the hitch corners. Try not to throw a pick.
Gonna run. Don't stop like that. Keep going. All right, I'll call timeout. Call the same play we had for a touchdown here. We still have two timeouts. Complete this pass. It'll stop the clock. Stay in the pocket. Quit bailing. All right. And, of course, now we got to call another timeout. Yeah, we're not running. What's the point of running? Go curls with the post. See if that post will be open. They're playing off on the outside, so curls should be open. I'm spamming the triangle for uh, no huddle. Get up there. Snap the ball. Get up there, get up there, get up there. Come on. On the ball. On the ball. Get up there, get up there. Watch the run, watch the run. Throw it, don't run. There we go, four seconds left. We can kick a field goal from there. That's a gain of five on the play. That'll make it second and four. And I can actually kick the field goal with my left hand. Boom. Nice. Nice way to end the half. <laughs> so I'm playing I'm playing halfway here. I can't actually uh, control the sticks, but we can we can make and choose better plays than what the CP is doing. So this this should get us uh, a better result this year. Let's do some simming. Get in there. Another touchdown. 38 nothing, guys. Told you this team's ready. And a pick. Forty nine yard field goal. Alright. Forty one nothing. Look at those chunk plays. There's another touchdown. We're gonna be playing our we're gonna be playing our backups in the fourth quarter. Another touchdown. 55 nothing. Jesus. <laughs> yeah, we've got our backup in. Manning's our backup. And there's another touchdown. All right. What a good way to start the season, man. <laughs> what a position. What a view. Jesus. That would have been a hell of a thumbnail for... Uh, that right there would have been a hell of a thumbnail. <laughs> All right, let's check these stats. 62 to nothing. Damn. We threw for over 500 yards. 539 passing yards. Got six touchdown passes, six sacks. <laughs> and we ran for 180 yards. Look at that. Wilson and Nance. Damn. Look at all those pancakes. We only had six TFLs. One sack, one pick.
All right. It's a good way to start the season. 62 to nothing. <laughs> In the sim. As you said, I only called a few plays. I mean, I called, what, two drives? Maybe three drives? Mizzou loses in overtime to Auburn. Not only did we score 62, but we got a shutout. What's up, JT? How you doing, man? So, that's some revenge on losing the bowl game to those guys last year. That also will help us a lot in recruiting. A whole lot in recruiting. Uh, man, the, uh, the hardest part about this damn cast, this broken bone, or two broken bones, is sleeping at night man my my elbow still hasn't healed right and my shoulder is sore because it's compensating for the wrist and the elbow and i like to sleep on my right side and right now that's extremely painful so i can't i can't find a comfortable place to sleep so um we actually have a couch upstairs that has a recliner in both end seats and we have a big huge like stadium si height um l-shaped couch over here on the other side of this tv um, and one part, one seat on the love seat part of it has a recliner, so I might just have to sleep on the recliner. See if that helps. Got a shit ton of points. Now we're playing uh, Central Florida, guys. How close are we to getting an upgrade? Yeah, we should get win this next game. Check recruiting. We do have some points to spend. Offer these guys. Didn't have the points to offer these guys last time, so we're just going to do it now. Probably shouldn't have offered the corner that many points behind. I'm gonna have to go find another corner. I'll go to the bottom first and look at this cornerback that I uh, just offered that I shouldn't have. And yeah, this tackle. I'm not taking this tackle off the board because uh, Tulane hasn't offered. So, he's a 66 overall, so, yeah, whatever. Yeah, this corner's going away. So, where's this guy? We're going to have to push him up the board and get some points on him. He's 300, make, just make it four. It gives me 100 points to spend. No, 300 points to spend. All right, let's look at these guys. All right, let's go back and look at the guys that we actually have points on and see. So I maxed this guy out and we still lost ground. Um, I'm not ready to take those points away because uh, if we can stay in there, we can get to a, a, a recruiting battle and try for him in the off season. This D end, we're toast on. And the corner, we're toast on. This guy, let's go ahead and max him out. Because um, we only need one, one D tackle, but we need two ends. So we're slowly gaining on him. Get him up to 500. We only need two, two wide receivers, yeah. So we dropped 200. So let's give him 200. We don't give him six because we'll, we'll start gaining grounds once we get him to 600. We'll gain ground. 
So we need two DNs and one D tackle, so that's good. Here's the other D tackle. I'm gonna go look at the guys at the bottom of the list here. Pullback, we're fine. This is the guy we think can play offensive line. <clears throat> He's toast. I don't, I don't have time or money to put on that guy. So we need two wide receivers, so we've got... Right, not sure we're going to get Rivero. We're leading on Bishop and Thompson we're leading, so I'm going to leave him on the board for now. This center... I'm going to give him an extra 200 points so we can stop losing ground. Um, you know what? We're just going to max him out. Hate to do that. Let's slide him up the board and take a look at him because he's 79 overall. We're losing ground on this guy. We can just put it on this guy because we only need one, right? So let's just cut bait on this guy and go after someone that no one's going after. And I don't even need to put 700, so let's drop that down to... 300, so I can uh, spread those out somewhere else. All right, back down here. Outside linebacker. We need uh, one outside linebacker. Give him 300. Even though I have two on the board. I have uh, a middle linebacker need also, so this guy is way better than the other middle linebacker we had, right? This guy, he's a 74. We have another middle on here. Let's take this guy's points away. We might get rid of this middle linebacker. I haven't decided yet. Um, he tackles a 75. We need one of those, right? We have a 79 here. So I'm not going to give this guy any points. He's just going to sit here and we'll keep gaining ground and he'll just be insurance for now. Same thing with this wide receiver. He's a 73. So if we fall farther behind on Rivera, I'll just cut him and give the points to Danny Edwards. Defensive end, like I said, we need two. There's one there. It's the 77, 73. Boise's going after him too, probably gonna fall behind. I'll just leave him down here with no points. Same thing with this linebacker, we're going to leave him on the board, no points. He's just insurance. Same thing with this middle. Where's the other, where's the other middle linebacker? He's a 74, right? Let's get rid of him. We've got other guys that no one is looking at. We'll give him 300 because we do need two wide receivers. And uh, if I can get him and the other guy, then we have two guys in the 70s. Yeah, Spectre, I always, I always start at level three and give them 100% on the scouting, just because it's, it's you're giving yourself a um, huge, huge penalty when you uh, can. You have to take three different times, basically 150 points to get those guys scouted. So that's just. Just me. That's how I deal with, deal with it. Let's give him 150. I don't need this wide receiver anymore, but I'm going to leave him on the board. I'm going to give this fullback points so we can get him done. So now we're just going to put everybody up higher on the board. 
keep track of them in the numerical order and go from there. All right. Yeah, before you start the dynasty. So what you do is you, first thing you do when you make a new dynasty is just go in and create a new coach. And my browser just died. Give me a second so I can get my uh, stream back. Come on. All right, it doesn't want to go out. Doesn't want to go to Twitch. Give me one second. Love it when it does that. So when you create a new dynasty, um, I create the coach first, and that's where you can. Um, well, you you create and do everything for him, and then when you go set up the dynasty itself, um, it's going to ask you uh, what level you want to start the coach at, how fast you want him to progress. Um, also, you choose what the save file name is for the dynasty. That's all on the same page, and I just choose level three. So, yeah, I don't I don't start him at like level twenty, but I, I don't start at zero or one or two. I, I start him at three so that we can get fully scouted in one shot. Go take a peek at the Spark 100 real quick and see if there's any low lock guys that no one's interested in. Five star quarterback that we don't need. No one wants. We literally don't need him. There's another quarterback. And another quarterback. Please be a wide receiver or a DB. No, oh, he's another quarterback. <laughs> Look at all of these quarterbacks in here. The f five star, four star wide receiver? Yeah, Auburn's after him, we won't get him. And of course, Notre Dame. Here's another quarterback. Let me sort by squat and see if there's any uh, athletes in here. There's a middles, there's a tackle. Jeez, oh, my dogs are going shit. Someone's coming over to uh, pick up the couch finally, and uh, they're losing their shit. Let's go back into the athletes and sword by squad because we might be able to find some other offensive linemen in there. Yeah, we sold your couch, Jimmy. You gotta come get it. It was only 250 bucks. You're fine, you're fine. Calm down. Hey, stiff arm. Is that a fullback? Yeah, there's nobody else in here. Okay, I just want to make sure. Let's save and we'll get in here and play Central Florida. Oh. My elbow's killing me today as much as my wrist. And I've already taken pain meds, so it shouldn't be hurting at all. So I'm on uh, Tramadol. Fun stuff. Sucks getting old. I would recommend not getting old. All right, Jimmy, so this is where we do it. Let me go set their um, their uniform first. All right, they're fine there. So I come in here and I set my uniform. 
Let's do our regular helmet. All right. And then on this page, you hit X to advance, right? This is where you choose the coach mode. So I've got my playbook on offense and defense. And the controls, you have regular, which is just how you regularly play the game. One button, coach. So we just hit done. And now we can uh, call the plays on offense and defense. Um, and if we don't sim the kicks, we have to kick. I just never played coach mode before ropes, and Jimmy didn't either, so I wanted to show him where it was. And so you can do that for um, any game. doesn't matter how your dynasty is set up. Look at that. We had 723 yards of offense. <laughs> Any injuries? They have a middle linebacker out for the year. That's not good. Oh, fuck. My wrist hurts so bad. All right. So if you hear people talking in the background, it's um, people who came to get the couch. And my son, my son's got it truck actually it's my truck that um, he's getting gifted to him he needs it for work so um, so he's going to uh, move it to their house for them it's somebody we used to uh, go to church together with so um, so he'll get 50 bucks for hauling it over there he'll pay for a tank of gas at least let's go Sim some defense here. That didn't take very long. Let's see what we do on offense. Ah, we threw a pick. Wonderful. Good God. All right. So we threw an interception. They kicked a field goal. We fumbled the kickoff. And then they got another touchdown and missed the extra point. Jeez. All right. Wake up, boys. God damn. That makes it second and six. Hey, home run for the Cardinals, Jimmy. Tommy Edmond, two-run shot. That dude, is, he had four hits last night. He's already got two today. Here you go, Ropes. If it's fourth and one, I'm going for it. There we go. Got the first down. Got through the one tackle, but uh, got plowed right to the ground at the, on the second one. Let's see. Let's go high stick or H stick. So next weekend is Labor Day weekend. I got a couple of family things going on Saturday and Sunday. Um, so I don't know if I'll stream over the weekend or not. It might be Saturday night. Um, might be Sunday night. I don't know. I'll let you guys know. Try to get one in on the weekend. Once the NFL season starts, I will not be streaming on Sundays. I stream at night. I used to stream uh, at night during the week all the time. Here we go. 
up the field. Used to stream on uh, Tuesdays and Thursday nights. Actually had uh, one night I didn't start streaming until like what ten o'clock, eleven o'clock, something like that. We streamed until like three o'clock in the morning. Uh, my NFL team is the Broncos. Um, it used to be the Arizona Cardinals when they were in St. Louis. And then they moved, and I stopped rooting for them, and then started rooting for the Broncos when I went to school out there because I went to Northern Colorado, so. My freshman year in college was Elway's first year in the, in the NFL. So, and then moved back here, and we got the Rams. So I was rooting for the Rams and the Broncos. And now that the Rams are gone, then it's straight Broncos. And for college football, it's Mizzou, since where my daughter goes in. Let's go. We're dinking and dunking too much here. Oh, you got to hold on to the ball. Damn it. The wrist is killing me. Wish he would not take off so much. That's the only problem with scrambling quarterbacks in uh, this game is they, they take off. They don't even get your guys... A chance to get open down the field and they just take off. Used to work for Mizzou. Cool. What did you? Oh, hit him in the back. All right, where are we? I think we're too well, too far away for a field goal. Education. That's cool. So it's only a 16-yard difference if we punt this ball out of bounds or we go for it. So we're going to go for it. What's the point of punting it into the end zone? Um, when we can take a shot. What I don't want him to do is take a sack here. Throw it. Just throw it away. Just throw it away. I mean, it ended up being a net same difference if you threw it away, but he's not going to run for 16 yards. There we go. This Y stick is one of my favorite plays. Now I have to do, I can't do what I do with this play in sim that I do normally. I'll send both those guys at the top of the screen on streaks and I'll send the running back on a wheel route. Um, and we burn those guys deep frequently. But it won't let me uh, call those uh, hot routes. Let's uh, call something we never call. There we go. Run him over. Keep running him over. There we go. Took four guys. About time my guy runs over everybody. Yeah, me calling play action. I don't call play action when I run the play because it, it zooms in so much that I can't see. Here we go. Yeah, these are beautiful uniforms. Love the helmet. This is an option pass. <laughs> you took too damn long. You got to throw it away. Lord. Took way too long. Throw the ball away. <laughs> what was that? That was a screen pass, and he just took two steps and threw it away. He never gave him a chance to get into the route. It's all right, let's go four verts. The sense of pressure is a little too tight there. He, he... Oh, jeez. 
Because if he throws that to the outside guy at the 50-yard line, that's a catch because he'd already beaten his cover, man. Yeah. All right, let's sim. Touchdown, Ingram, our halfback from the quarterback. That'll work. And we, they fumble the ball. We have it on their five, guys. T. Clink, welcome in, man. How you doing? We, uh, this is our second game of the season. Boom, touchdown. We absolutely manhandled East Carolina, the team we lost to in our bowl game last year. We beat them 62 to nothing with 700 yards of offense. Um, and we threw for over 500 yards. <laughs> 70 yard touchdown by their running back. All right. I see how this is going to be. <laughs> Another touchdown. Let's go, defense. There we go. All right, so even though this is four verts, I like calling this play to run everybody off so we can hit the slant across the middle. And he's going to bail. And he keeps running into his offensive lineman. What the fuck? I noticed this with Middle Tennessee State, too. That's a team I was playing to... Uh, Test out the uh, coach mode. Quarterback goes to scramble. He just runs into his offensive lineman, so it's a butt sack all the time. Called our last time out. Why would we run? Why would we run on third and four? I love how they run to the line of scrimmage. It's hilarious. Hit him. Slant. Here we go. Ah. Must not have had anybody open. That's all right. Trying to keep them with the same uh, same guys on the field, keep them tired. Let's try this tight end post. We actually do have good tight ends. That's a backwards pass. Come on, why would you throw that pass? Just throw it away. He throws it away other times. Come on, get back to the line of scrimmage, guys. Slow ass. Tight end. Hey, at least he threw that away. All right, fourth and 15. Where are we at? Our own 42. We'll punt that. UCF kickoff. All right, we get the ball. Let's run the ball a little bit. Yeah, the guys behind him are uh, like 10 points less overall. He's a 91, and the other two guys are 82 and 81 as uh, redshirt freshmen. He's clearly our best quarterback. This empty stick, I'd send the X receiver on a streak. That inside slot guy right there along the hashes, I would send him on a streak. All right, well, got half of it back. He's got the ball. 
There we go. Good job. Gotta keep these guys honest and run the ball a little bit. We've got a good running back. Keep him from making too many bad decisions in the uh, pocket. Running into his offensive lineman and throwing the ball away when several guys are open. So, my uh, speed threshold is set at. Uh, 25, which I think somebody tested it in 25 as the uh, the real 40 times. So if you put it at zero, they're going to run faster than what their actual 40 time is. There we go. Up the field. He's only got eight yards rushing because of the sacks. All right, let's try this. Quit running. He still got the first down, but good lord. He was in the pocket for like two seconds and he takes off. All right, Lamar, calm down, buddy. This is a read option. Now we're passing. And he takes off again. And he runs right into the defensive end. Doesn't go around him. Doesn't cut inside. He just ran right into him. Watch this. He runs right to him. Oh, this slot drive. Let's see if we can get this uh, slot guy at the top. Be open. There he is. He's open. Throw it to him. Not that guy. Unfucking real. What a shitty play. That whole play sucked. He had a guy wide open over the middle. Right there. 10 is wide open. Not 10. There was another guy that went down the field and he was wide open at the. Uh... We'll kick the field goal. I got to kick this. Ha, huh, 14. 14 mile an hour. Does he make it? Boom. We got it. All right, so if they score a touchdown, you know they're going to go for two. All right, so we're up five. Let's just sim. And of course, three and out. Actually, ropes, all he did was hit X. It kicked for me. <laughs> oh, man, he's sliding. He got smoked upside the head. That's a penalty. Come on. Come on. Hustle. You got three minutes left. We're down 12 points. Dry guy, what's up, man? Welcome in. Welcome in. Up the field. Out of bounds, good, stop the clock. Well, it's a first down. First down will stop the clock. How you doing today? How's your weekend been? Snap the ball. A little too much, that was 15 yards over his head. Alright. 
the uh, slot receiver right next to the DN should be going straight up the straight up the middle to the first down marker and cutting across. And of course we throw it short to the halfback instead. Get up, get up, get up, get up. We don't have all time. Come on, we don't have all day. Man, we got to go for it. Come on, get up. What's up, Maggie? How are you? My son's dog is here. <clears throat> oh, stop it. Oh, I know. She's an Aussie doodle. There we go. Get to the ground. Wow, he didn't get sacked. I'm shocked. <laughs> Thought for sure he was going to get sacked. That's fine. Stop the clock, but wow. Oh, man. That was a rocket. All right. Let's see if we can get close to the first down on this. He runs out of bounds. Hey, at least he stopped the clock, but he could have gone up the field for a couple more yards and stepped out after he got the first down. Come on, get up, get up, get up, get up. Hurry up, let's go. On the ball. On the ball. Touchdown. There we go. Already dropped it. All right. Well, at least it stopped the clock. That's fine. And we're not running the ball. Not happening. There we go. All right. Now we got to do something that's never going to happen, and that's uh, get the onside kick. I'm seriously considering kicking the ball off and not doing the onside. So if we stop them, we have a shorter field as opposed to getting the ball deep in our own end. I think I am kicking the ball off. We have three timeouts. If we can stop them, we'll have a much shorter field to go, so. There we go. Don't let them run the ball back. Just got to play good defense now. Now I will call plays or defense here because we know they're going to run, right? Get him. Stop him. Stop him. All right. Good job, Spectre. Two more stops. Let's go. Get there, get there, get there. 
And out of bounds. <laughs> nice. All right. So we are going to go 5 2. Oh, shit. Well, that hurt. We had him right where we wanted. Right where we wanted. Did everything right, but uh, tackled the quarterback. Just let him score. If we can hold him to a field goal, we can still score a touchdown. Get a two-pointer. That sucks. We did everything right, and uh, nobody covered the quarterback. Oh, well. That's the way it goes. Non-conference game. That's okay. We weren't going to win a natty this year anyway, so that's okay. Had sound reasoning for that decision. Did a good job kicking the kickoff out of the end zone. And then we, uh, oh, just ran him over like a fucking speed bump. And then uh, just couldn't cover the uh, edge. It's all right. Oh, well, that's all right. We had nobody visiting, so it didn't really hurt us, but the fucking quarterback, 140 yards on the ground. Wait for it to go through these stupid screens. If we'd have won that game, we'd have had some decent stats. But I got a coach upgrade. Well. Yeah, Clink, I've had uh, the CPU uh, hit stick me when they were doing an onside kick and I recover it. A couple of times I've had them hit stick me and force a fumble. Seems like the only way you can actually get a uh, Remeric Binky. What a name. Welcome in, welcome in. That might be the only way to get an onside kick, though, is hit stick them after they get it.
These transition screens take forever. Let's go, let's go. All right. Let's go look at the, the damage on the recruiting side. All right, we'll be number one next week. That's good. Number one next week there. Already number one there. And there. All right, so we need one D-tackle, but I actually will take two. Not not going to be uh, turning away D-tackles. Need two defensive ends. We need outside and a middle, so one of these guys will slide into the middle. Two wide receivers. I'll take points away from him now. Um, let's give this guy 400. Try and push him a little bit further up. right so we've got those two guys there so I'll take his points away he doesn't get any points pull back push him up the board get him up to 300 as well Push all the guys that we're putting points on higher up. Actually, I don't need points on him anymore. Don't need there, don't need that. Leaving him on the board for now. All right, we're good to go. And we get to play Georgia San Jose State. I don't like the Black Sox at all. <clears throat> yeah, we'll go with the yellow helmet this time. And hopefully we'll do uh, a little bit more fast simming in this game and less uh, actual gameplay been doing this for two hours and this is only our third game so we got to pick up the pace hello maggie how are you <laughs> hello how are you i know i would pick her up but i can't do that with my wrist so sorry q i'd show you here here i can do this there you go maggie how are you how is the mags yeah She brought me a tennis ball. Come on, let's go. Go get it. And another rain game. Good Lord, how many rain games are we going to have this year? And it's raining in California. Northern California. George can attest they have a uh, drought going on, so it shouldn't be this much rain. Wow, we're just gonna give up yards like crazy this year. Come on, we have a much we have a ninety something overall team, man. Let's go. Here we go, touchdown. Go D, step up, make a play, stop him. Nope. And 
Let me throw a pick. Now we're going to be down two scores. And it's raining hard. Look at that. Throw it. And it's picked again. <laughs> Touchdown. All right, down six. Let's go. Boom. End of the half on a touchdown. All right, up 21-20. And they missed the field goal. All right, let's run some plays. There we go, five yards on first down, that works. Everybody's all wet and muddy. Come on. Don't scramble. Find somebody, throw a pass. Let's go. Use your arm. All right, Robes, here's the play-action play. Oh, just shy. Couldn't turn up. Got him before he could turn up the field. All right, that's fine. All right, let's run this ball, move the chains. There we go. Get through the line. Don't fumble. Good job. Damn, he got blasted. <laughs> he got smoked. Bent his ass right back. Wow. All right, boys. Five or six yards. Make a nice short third down. Catch the ball. Catch the ball. Why do these running backs drop so many passes? We're going deep. <laughs> yeah, we're going for it on fourth down. It's more like two yards. Just fourth and one, that's almost a full two yards. Try a stretch play. See if we can get to the edge or not. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. Too muddy. No chance at all. They were all over that play. All right, well, we'll try something else here. Second and 12. Let's go empty stick. Hopefully the uh, one of these two guys at the top of the screen are open on the slant. Of course, he's going to take off and run. He won't wait for the guys to get open. Oh, come on. Third 
Hey, well, that's better than me. I had three the first year, right? I think it took me till year four to get that many. Come on, up the field. Push them out of bounds, fourth and seven. It's going to be too long of a field goal, right? Yeah, go for it. It's like 55 yards. We're not ready to kick those yet. There we go. Nice strike. Where's that been all game? Snap the ball. God, how many times I got to hit X to snap the ball? Touchdown. Oh, toe tap in the back of the end zone. Nice job, Hayes. Nice throw. Ball's moonwalking on the end line. All right, defense. Let's hold them. Make a stop. Come on, guys. Stop them. Of course not. Tie game. You're going to go read option. <laughs> going to kill you, huh? Go. Up the field. Hold on to the ball. Yeah, I remade... Uh, I, I uh, redid a bunch of conferences in the other one that I was testing this out on. And... Uh, do I want? I actually took Mizzou and Texas A&M out of the big uh, S, S, out of the SEC and put them back in the Big 12, and then I moved um, Louisville. Who did I move? Louisville and somebody else to the SEC. West Virginia. If it's fourth and inches, we are going to go for it. Fourth and a yard and a half. Let's go, boys. Block up front. There we go, first down. Hold the ball. Hold the ball. That's a gain of eight on the play. That makes it first and ten. Roger, Roger. Quit running. They haven't even had a chance to get downfield and get open. That's like three seconds in the pocket and he bails. Fucking stand in the pocket and throw the ball. Oh, and he throws a pick. Son of a bitch. That was a terrible throw. Had a defender deep, and he had a defender between him and the receiver. What, what kind of play was that? It was terrible. All right, we got three minutes to go 80 yards. We actually don't even have to go a full 80 yards. We just got to kick a field goal. Catch the ball. Come on, man. This is a conference game. There he goes running again. All right, let's get the first down. There we go. Quick pass right over the middle. Run away from the defenders. 
Why do they have the UCLA Bruin on the sideline? <laughs> Yeah, that'll work. Second down three. We can run the ball here. That'll bring up second and three. This guy's got to chill out with the picks, though. He's got three picks. Four touchdowns, three picks. That's not good. There we go. Up the middle. Go, Navarro. Or uh, Ingram, sorry. Navarro was the quarterback in the other team. Go. Ah. Nobody wants to block the linebacker. Hello, Maggie. I can't play right now. I'm busy. I'm busy. Where's Zuzu at? Where's the zoo and the chi at, huh? Where are they? Up the field. First down. There we go. Go get it. It's over there. Look, it's over there. Guess because it's a bear. Oh, you almost threw a pick. Where, where, where was that to? Guess that was the closest thing to a bear he could find in the game, I guess. All right. There we go. In field goal range, stay in bounds. We'll let this clock run down. Third and four. We're actually going to run the ball. T. Clink, he didn't go. We had a snafu with the ticket, and um, he didn't get to go. So now we got to try and reschedule and do it again, or I got to pay $1,800 to have somebody. Uh, Put it on a flatbed and drive it to us. They're not going to call a timeout. I'm going to I'm going to run this all the way down and call timeout myself. Now I'm not in a hurry. <laughs> Let them burn their timeouts because it doesn't matter. I turn off that ice to kicker shit because it never works. It's pointless. One more time. All right, now we can go. Boom, game over, we win. Yay! That's good, that was a conference match. That was uh, in our division too, so we needed that. That was a clutch drive. I think the CPU would have run the ball a whole lot less on that drive and thrown the ball a lot, so they would have had time to come back down the field. Yeah. I told George that uh, la it was the last season San Jose was like, no, it was the second season, third season. San Jose went like 0 for 12, 0 and 12, and they gave up like 300 more, 300 more points allowed than they scored. And he's like, that's not my team. That's not my team. <laughs> my team doesn't do that. There we go. Three picks, four sacks. Didn't run the ball very well. Got the win. Should have beat UCF, but 
I'd rather lose to them and, and win these games in conference. All right, we get to upgrade my head coach, which I desperately need. So now we have an extra 3,000 points to spend. We'll do that one more time and that'll give us a full 15,000 in the off season. What? Your ball is over there somewhere. It's not down here, baby. No, no. I don't know where it is. What did you do? Hmm? I don't have it. Where's Zuzu at? Go get Zuzu. Where's Zoo? Where's the Zoo? Hmm? <laughs> no, you can't bite my cast. She's hilarious. Dog has, dog has uh, unlimited, unlimited uh, energy and speed. I mean, it's a Australian shepherd dog, but it's also mixed with a doodle. So, dog is has no off button at all. Go update update. All right, six visits. Let's get these guys in here and get these guys signed. Utah States kick their ass. All right, I need to throw to the tight end. Well, I don't have a choice. I can't throw to the tight end as the... Uh, Head coach, it just throws to whoever, so all I can do is uh, call the play and whoever's open is open. All coming in for Utah State. Let's, let's look at our uh, top schools. So we're number one there, number one there. Gotta get visits for those guys. All right, so Dion is 700, so I'm gonna take 200 points off of him and give it to one of these guys that is higher up to try and get them in for a visit. Which guy? All right, he's at 24, 23. Tell you what, let's give them both 100 instead of split, instead of giving it everybody. D tackle, wide receiver, he needs another week. To bend. Yeah. Two ends, one tackle. So let's take another 200 points off of this guy. All right, so DN, D tackle, DN, right? Get there, tight end. Drop a hundred off of him. He's good to go. How many points is he? He's at twelve hundred. Take another point off of him. We're off the. He's fine. Let's give it to this guy. Under the corner. Give it to the guard. Try and push him up a little bit. Need to get these visits. 700 on the center. We're gaining ground, but we're not there yet. Um, he's fine. These guys were all number one on, or we're moving up. No hurry. These are all backup guys, just in case. All right. What I will do. As we're gonna go back out here and we're gonna do low lock and see if there's any stud players that are just sitting here because we found an 80 overall outside linebacker in week 10 
um, two seasons ago. So we're just going to look um, and sort by low lock. See what's out there. Like, like I said, we don't need this five-star quarterback, but he's sitting out here with nothing. Don't need him. Same thing with that quarterback. Is there any other athletes out here? There's a 4-5. He could play safety. Definitely not a corner. But uh, we don't need safeties. Tight ends we don't need. Already got it. Corner. Only a 64. So there's nothing. So... We'll just stick with what we have. Save, and um, we're gonna do. We're gonna go into the game, but I'm gonna do way more fast simming on this game. We should be able to handle Ball State. Um, we got to get through some games. I'm taking too damn long. This is gonna be a seven, eight hour stream. I don't want to be here that long. It's already two thirty. Been here two and a half hours, and only what three games in. We should be able to handle these guys in a straight sim. Got red pants. I've got to get eight wins at least to get this contract extension. So I'm kind of being a little more hands-on with this particular season. But shit, we're 93. We shouldn't be losing any of these games into the uh, 70 overall teams in the uh, fast sim. But <laughs> I, I don't trust it right now. So Their offense is terrible. Under 300 yards of offense, and we're almost at 500. Is it another rain game? No, it's not. Thank God. I've done a couple of college volleyball matches with Ball State. Not there. They, they were here in town both times. All right. Why do we start slow all the time? Interception. That works. And three and out. What the fuck? Come on. This team is trash. Do something. Alright, we're going to have to take over on uh, offense after we give up this touchdown. God damn. Nice field. Ooh, lowers his head. Nice run. No, I don't. I don't need to see that replay. It would've been nice if he had thrown that ball instead. Let's go. Here we go. About took his hands off on that one. That was a rocket. <laughs> Hey, have you guys heard any news on uh, J.K. Dobbins? Does he uh, he blow his knee out, or they're still waiting on the MRI results on that? go another first down they, they cannot handle they can't handle the read option that's for sure all right play action let's go deep see if we can hit a shot down the middle here what 
I'll take the out. All right. Inside the 15. Works for me. 15 yards. 21 yards, I'm sorry, but inside the 15 yard line is what I meant. Curls for the girls, Jimmy. Curls for the girls right here. I can't see the bottom of the screen, but I can see the top. And he's just going to run into the defensive line again. Come on. Boom. All right. Nice job. Lower the head. That was fourth and one. We were going to go for it anyway. All right. Here's one of my favorite goal line runs. Oh, offensive line didn't do their job. Come on, boys. All right. Inside zone, they seem to block better for us, so hopefully that stays true. Here we go. He just ran that linebacker over like nobody's business. What's up, Tanner? How are you? Yeah, Northern Colorado Bears. Let's go, boys. Need another score before half. Hey, thanks for the follow. Of course. Throw the ball away, for God's sake. You familiar with Northern Colorado? You from Colorado? Or uh, go to UNC? Come on, get up there. Oh, he didn't get in there. Ooh, barely got it. That was close. Could have easily said fourth and inches. All right, time to take a shot here. <clears throat> and of course, he's going to run right into his own offensive line. Just throw it away. You want to go to Colorado one day? I'm in West Virginia. Yeah, it's beautiful. I live there for... Uh, Five years, 83 to 88. I'm sure it uh, looks the same, but it's not the same as far as, uh, there you go, people there. Had a lot of people move in from out of state. Kind of wrecked it. Let's go. Um, I lived in Denver, but I went to college at uh, Northern Colorado, the team I'm playing. They're about an hour north of Denver and an hour south of Cheyenne, um, Cheyenne, Wyoming, where uh, University of Wyoming is. They're like a uh, half hour east of uh, Colorado State. And Ball State, I think they were. I didn't. I don't think I picked them. I think they were on the schedule. I did. A, I did adjust and remove some of the. Uh, 
Power Five teams they wanted me to play because I, I got to get eight wins so I can not get fired. <laughs> Let's go. It's ridiculous that this team can't move the ball right now unless I'm running the plays. Come on, throw the ball. Trust your offensive line. Toss it to the short side, so if they string it out, we'll just run out of bounds. Or he'll just blow right by my uh, offensive lineman who did nothing on that play. He just, look at this. He just let him come right by. Never made an attempt to, to block that guy. What the fuck? <laughs> Try this vertical Y shake. Hopefully this guy over the middle is open. That guy right there. That's fine. Half the yards. With the clock run, third and five. All right, go tight end post. See if the uh, tight end's open or the uh, slack guy on the slant. There you go. Nice throw. Out of bounds. We got three timeouts in 30 seconds, so we can actually run the ball here. We don't have to throw it. What? What's wrong? <laughs> My son's dog is just sitting here begging. I don't know what she wants. Throw it. Catch. Get in there. There we go. Touchdown. Way to break that tackle. What's up, Megs? How are you? No, you can't bite the cast. No. <laughs> All right. It should be a lot uh, higher than a seven-point lead, but we'll, we'll take this. Get these guys uh, rolling in the second half. There we go. Let's go. Touchdown. Big, big gain. Who was that? 31 yards to Nance. All right. Sim again. Sim's going to be well. We'll let him sim. And that's less I have to do. And we didn't get it on fourth down. That sucks. Right, minute three left in the third. Let's try this uh, play action F slide. Oh. Nice throw. Jay Porter comedy with a rate of three. Welcome in. Appreciate it. How you guys doing today? Let's go, D. 51, Mike. Mike, 51. Ball, 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 ball. Yeah, get that. Out of bounds, third and six. Got to go up the field a little more. That'll bring up third and six. Come on, guys. Do something productive. Let's go. None of those plays. Go stick and nod. One of Jimmy's favorite plays. Give me a second. We're going to send out a bunch of uh, shout outs right now because I've been 
I've been uh, tardy here. I'll throw some more out here in a second. She was over here begging. Don't know why she's begging. All right, let's go. Down the field. Nope. Missed the field goal. We are just not taking advantage of field position. Damn it. All right, we'll just do this. Shout out JT Gaming. Another NCAA streamer. Does MLB the show as well. Who else is in here? Give me a second. We'll do a bunch of shout outs right now. Jimmy. Got to do Jimmy. Rock. Rocky stream too. All right. All right. We got three minutes left. We're up two scores. Let's try to get this down the field and at least get a get a field goal. Finish off this game. Nice, there we go. Tuck it in two. I like those big gains on first down. That makes it second and two. Let's run this ball. Try and get this first down. Eat a little time on the clock here. What else we got in here? Mr. J. Oh, I forget I gotta snap the ball. And he's gone. Wow. I'm doing a shout out and I look up and my guy's down the entire sideline. <laughs> totally missed that play. That was just supposed to be a power run and they uh, hammered the shit out of it. Got it like that. 60 yards. All right. Well, I should whine and complain about it more often, right? Do more shout outs. My guys will play better. <laughs> Oh, he's still got 226 left. We're going to score again. Boom. 58 seconds. Let's just run out the clock. There we go. Maybe that's the trick. If we're losing. I got to do shout outs. Or at least not scoring as many points as we uh, need. So let's uh, check it. 320 yards. He only had one touchdown. He had 60 yards on that one play. So that, that got him uh, over 100. Uh, this is normal distribution for how I play in user. We just spread it around. Damn, look at those pancakes. <clears throat> I need to make a new uh, an emoji. I got to get another slot open, so I need some more subs to get that. But um, I'll make an IHOP one. Let's go, let's go. Nebraska. Oh, Nebraska knocked off Oklahoma. Did you see that? Look at this. Look at the scores. Number one Oklahoma lost. It's not going to show it. It's in the sim. So you know that dude that, I guess, what is it, Haas or whatever, that guy that was uh, following everybody and doing uh, hate raids and stuff? I think they got banned. Um, they followed my BotFather2 account, so I went to go look him up and, and uh, tried to go to the uh, profile, and it said uh, something went wrong, so it's, it's no longer around. Like, 
Why, why would you follow my bot? My bot doesn't stream ever. All right, we got a bunch of visits for this Utah State game, so um, definitely need these guys to uh, be on point, get a big conference victory. Cardinals are up 3-1 to one on the uh, Pirates in the top of the ninth, so that's good. That'll give us uh, 3 out of 4 there if we uh, hang on. We were up we were up 7-3 to three the other night and gave up 8 runs before we got an out in the bottom of the 7th and lost, lost the game. Fucking terrible. Let's get these visits scheduled. Oh yeah, I'm sure Jimmy, you were really broken up over that. <laughs> but we're gonna win three out of four, so it sucks though. We get the Reds um, Monday, so we have like the Reds, the Dodgers, the Reds, and the Brewers. So we're either gonna make up a lot of ground, or we're gonna get smoked and out of the playoffs pretty quick. So still need these guys to do some work. Let's drop him by a hundred and give it to this D tackle. Still don't have a uh, commit yet, but that is what it is. We're only looking for 15, so this is a huge week. This uh, we probably have 12 guys visiting this week, right? So uh, it's going to be one of those where we might get a bunch of uh, yellow. I guarantee, if I was playing, we would get a bunch of yellow, but never know with the sim. Almost 20 points better. There you go. Be nice and easy. Blue on white. <clears throat> What conference did you put Illinois State in, Specta? Did you did you put them in the Big 12? Is that what you said? Let's go. Load. All right, injury report. No injuries. They're missing their halfback. This doesn't show nearly all the players. So I know we have to run for 100 and pass for 250, and I think we have to throw for 100 to the tight end. And, and there's uh, no bad weather. I still haven't seen a snow game. We should have snow in October, November with this team. I just hit R1 for Sim. Alright, well, he's not going to do well doing that, so let's go back and actually call the right play. I have no idea what play they called. He runs up the middle right into his own offensive line. Just throw it away.
Nice. Split the two defenders, slid through, got the first down. I'll take that. Look at this. He stops. Boom, right between them. And then the big boy shoves them all up the field for the first down. So I'll take that. Let's try this inside under one. There he goes again, running right into the tackle, and he fumbled. That's got to be uh, down. There's no way that's a fumble. Wow. Yes. He was not down. I mean, he, he was down. That was not a fumble. He, that ball came out. Right. Well. <laughs> I was wrong. There you go. At least he turned up and didn't just run straight out of bounds. But it was only an extra yard. I'm going to do this fake jet sweep. Ooh, almost got it. Just shy. Thought he was going to break that tackle and take off, and the guy got him from behind. <clears throat> it's probably going to be a negative play. Watch. Just read option. He's going to read it wrong and get a negative play. Oh. Got some moves. Look at that sideways wiggle, man. That was a nice run. <laughs> uh, guy gets tackled by a guy on the ground. Defensive lineman gets pancaked and he trips over his feet. God. <laughs> that was terrible. There you go. First down. Nice throw.
Don't go out. All right, never mind. I was going to say, don't go outside. He had a hole right up the middle to go straight in. He missed the extra point. No. We got it. That was a penalty on the defense. Sorry. Or the offense. Us. Stop them. Come on, D. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. They were in there in a hurry. Glad he got rid of it fast. That was going to be a big time sack, maybe a fumble if he doesn't throw it right then. What's up, Maggie? How are you? Hello. I know. She wants to play with her paw. <laughs> I can't play right now. I'm busy. I know. You should go outside with Zuzu and Chica. Mm -hmm. Take him outside. Tell him to go outside and play in the yard. There we go. Get that first down. So we do got to get uh, 250 and 100. We should be able to get our 250, not a problem. So we got to focus on running the ball still. Especially at this point in the game when it's not a two minute drill. Keep pushing. Don't fumble. There we go. Five yards. I'll take it. Should get us to at least 50 yards right now. Don't run to him. You had plenty of room up the middle. Why would you run outside to the guy that's blitzing? Follow your line up the middle. Hit him. Here we go. Nice. Come on. Usually fake that. I went ahead and did the uh, jet sweep instead. Slowing the pace down, trying to eat some of this clock. chains and get this down and score with less than two minutes left unless he's just gonna plow right through everybody he's not down yet there we go yeah UNC it's um I don't remember if it's uh NCAA 13 or 14 I don't remember because there's a filter you can put on there to find them but all you got to do is filter by uh, Colorado and you'll be able to find it I just wish they had yellow pants. That would have been that would have been so much nicer to have. Be able to wear yellow helmet, yellow pants, or blue helmet with yellow pants instead of having to wear white. All right, we got plenty of rush yards for the first half. So Here we go. Walked in. I was most worried about getting our 100 yards rushing, so I kind of focused on running a lot in that particular uh, in that particular drive to make sure we got the the yards we need. <clears throat> All right, 
right, now we gotta play some defense. There we go. Two minute drill. Might as well go four verts, right? Hold the ball, don't fumble. Good job. If you've watched uh, Stoner Gamer stream at all, he's uh, he used uh, Taco Bell. Um, there is a Taco Bell team in there, Taco Bell Tacos. It's probably listed as, uh, instead of FBS or FCS, it's listed as uh, Other. There is a Taco Bell in there. Try this X follow. I haven't ever called this play, so let's see what happens. We got our 100 yards. Now we can focus on passing the ball, not getting sacked. Well, Jimmy, you'll be happy. Cardinals just lost a walk-off three-run shot in the bottom of the ninth off Reyes. Sugo, the Japanese guy. He uh, he almost put it in the water. He put it way up in those right field bleachers. Throw it. Get up there! Get up there! Get up there! a lot longer than I expected. I gotta make sure I save five seconds on the clock here if I ever wanna do that uh wanna do that. Spike it. Make it? Boom. There we go. Alright, up by eleven at the half. March them down the field. This is kinda cool being able to call plays and everything, but having no control, so you kinda just gotta deal with your players and their ratings. So that makes their ratings worth more than uh, and less on your own skill, so. And they missed a field goal. Let's sim. Boom! Touchdown. Go D. Step up. Just another field goal. And another touchdown. And another touchdown. <laughs> this is what this team should be doing in the sim. We get the backups in there. Missed the field goal. That's all right. Rep 32 points. Here we go. That was a big win. Hopefully we get a bunch of recruits uh, commit this week because we have none right now. We need to get some. I mean, we got 15, 15 guys at least that we need to uh, nail down this year. So be nice if we can get five or six of them right here.
All right, he threw for 300 yards, no picks, three sacks, two touchdowns. Ran for over 100. Nice. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, I kind of got to hold their hand and walk them through some of this, Specter. Uh, this quarterback, is he's good, and he drives me insane at the same time. He's definitely not Mahomes. <laughs> but um, when I was I was playing with Mahomes, I was Mahomes. So, you know, it was my decision-making, not his. and see what we have. Yeah, got a 91, 88, and 83, 82, 82. I really don't need two D-tackles. So I'm going to take some points away from one of those D-tackles and give it to somebody else. I really don't need to at all. I just want to make sure I got one. So, And neither one of them are fast enough to play uh, D-end. Some of those outside linebackers we have further down the list are the ones that we were going to move to D-end if we couldn't get those other guys, so. And honestly, I wouldn't be too disappointed if our junior defensive tackle that's a 91 went pro, um, because we've got sophomore, a junior, a freshman, freshman behind him, so. Got the defensive end, got the right tackle, got the fullback, got the center. All right. Center's going to move to guard. This guy's going to go to guard. Um, one D end. Need one more tackle. Got the fullback. That'll let us put some, about 700 points on some of these guys. So we need one more D end. Seventy-nine, he's seventy-five. I'm gonna let this guy go. Max, max. Really hoping this guy is a uh, offensive lineman, this Ben Martin guy. And we threw this guy in the board, but we don't need him, so he's going away. And the fullback is going away because we don't need him anymore since we got the other guy. Need one more tackle, right? Tackle up here or higher. There's a guard. We needed two guards and two tackles, so I'm going to go look and see if there's another tackle out here um, at 73% locked. Probably won't be, but you never know.
We have to have a 4 3 40 halfback, wouldn't it? <clears throat> All right. We're done. We're done. We'll get some better players next year um, on the offensive line. We'll, we'll target these guys next year. Got Nevada. Save real quick. We'll do. Uh, we'll go into the game, but do more of fast sim on this one. We won't play it a whole lot unless we absolutely have to jump in on offense. We'll uh, we'll sim out the whole first quarter, maybe the whole first half, and see how we stand. They had a pretty decent offense, but their defense sucks. All right, so they're dark blue. Start simming these a little bit faster. Let's go. <clears throat> Can't imagine what this would feel like if I hadn't taken a pain pill today because it fucking hurts already. Right. Injury. What's our injury look? Come on. They lost a center for nine weeks, so we have no injuries. That's good. Gotta love that. Come on. Load the game. Oh yeah, I forget Nevada plays with a soccer field on their football field. Alright, we're going to sim the whole first quarter. There we go. Touchdown. Interception. Touchdown. And they get one back. 14-7. Touchdown. There we go. And the answer right back. And here we go all the way down and get another one. We're just going to shred each other's defense. And did we score? Yeah. Thirty-five seventeen. And we fumbled and gave up a touchdown. Field goal though. Fourteen point lead. Get another field goal. Going. Here we go. Forty eight twenty four. We stopped him on the five. All right, let's call some plays. Oh, it's defense. They're on our five. All right, never mind. God, fumbled again. Come on, boys. Quit turning the ball over. Ten-point game. Just giving it away. Let's go. Here he goes. Mad Scrambler. Daryl LaMonica, the uh, Raiders quarterback from the 60s and early 70s, has nothing on this dude, man. That's his, that was his nickname, NFL quarterback Daryl LaMonica, the Mad Scrambler. Boom, nice throw. Hit him on the run. 438 yards passing. Nice run, Espinosa. Wonder why he's playing so much. Did the other guy get hurt? Or is he just tired? I mean, eight carries is a lot of carries. I know, we're just trading touchdowns, man. 
Well, they have an 86 offense. It wasn't like Nevada's offense was dog shit, but their defense is 77 or something like that, so they, there was a huge difference. I'm going to run it again. Because um, I'm rocking a 93, uh, I'm sorry, 95 offense, 93 defense. All right, now we got to throw the ball and hope he doesn't scramble. This play. This play, he usually stays in the pocket and throws and doesn't scramble, but you never know. <laughs> you never know with this guy. Here we go. And he fumbled. Thank God our uh, tight end or running back, whoever that was, was there to pick it up. A read option. He's going to run. Let's make it a designed run. Spread those guys out. He's got 90 speed, so if he ever uh, breaks a tackle and gets into the secondary, he could be gone. I'll let the clock tick down a little bit. 10-point lead. If we can get another touchdown, that'll make it a three-score game, and that'll pretty much end it. If we have to kick a field goal, it's only a two-score two game. It'd be 13 points, so... Let's eat some clocks so they don't have time. Boom. Plot him over with his helmet right in the chest. Charles Baker. Our, our halfback must be hurt. Eat some more clock. Look at this. This is a dive right up the middle. They're all spread out. Look how far away the linebackers and safeties are. Here we go. Hey, give me a second. I want to check his injury status. I want to know. Ingram, two weeks, pulled groin. I think we have a bye week coming up in week eight, so that should knock one of the games off of that, so... This should be a touchdown over the middle. One of these two guys inside on the right at the top of the screen. Slant. Throw it now. Or run it. That works too. Just don't fumble it. Both those guys were open and he just took off and ran. <laughs> All right. Alabama knocks off number one Miami. Shocker. V Dub, hey, welcome in, man. How you doing? We are uh, we're in year five with Northern Colorado, man. Trying not to get. Uh, Trying to get a contract extension. We're in the last year of my uh, contract, and I haven't gotten an extension yet. Trying to uh, win this Mountain West and uh, get into our second bowl game here. So, how you doing today, man? Have a good weekend. Check these game stats real quick. All right. 35 of 48 for 448, four touchdowns, only one sack, no picks. That was a good game. So, seven, eight, yeah, so we barely got our 100 yards rushing. Ingram got hurt on the first carry of the game, looks like. Nine pancakes. Have you guys ever seen a guard with nine pancakes? Look at that. Look at this. 16, we had 25 pancakes. 25 what the fuck is that all right that deserves a picture i have never seen 25 pancakes in a game before <laughs> you gotta be shitting me wow
25. I know, they never count when I play as a user. I never get pancakes, ever. If I sim, I get assisted tackles and pancakes, but if I play, I never get either, either one of them. Look at the top. Florida State and South Carolina. Carolina wins at 69-66 in whatever, however many overtimes that was. That was at least four overtimes. <laughs> All right, so this bye week will eat up one of the weeks he's out, and he'll miss the next game, and then he's going to be, like, questionable or probable, so he's probably still going to make... Probably still gonna miss another game. Still, probably still miss two games regardless. But whatever. Yeah, that was off the hook, man. <laughs> my uh, left tackle is a 91 senior. My left guard, the one that had nine pancakes, is an 87 senior. You got an 88 junior center, an 85 junior right guard, and an 85 sophomore right tackle. I only have one wide receiver that's not an 81. And that'll change after we uh, bring these other two guys in, but they can just sit and uh, bake in the oven for a year or two. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh. This is fucking killing me. Hopefully I'll get some good news Tuesday. If I get bad news on Tuesday, that'll probably take me out for the entire volleyball season. So shouldn't be bad news, but I've been using my hand probably more than, than I should. I don't know. All right, we got one of the corners. We got one of the wide receivers. So we need one more of each. And we have a crap ton of guys ready to uh, visit. Let's get this offensive coordinator upgrade first before I forget. <clears throat> we'll go with throw power, throw accuracy. Uh, no, I'm a volleyball ref. I ref high school club and college. I got a defensive coordinator one to upgrade too. I'll fix that in a minute. There. We had no luck with the offensive line this year. Actually, we're going to drop it off to him, put it on there, give it back to the corner. All right, so these guys are all backups, insurance policies. All right, let's go by position so I know. Take that back. Do our visits first, and then we'll go back in. So D tackle is going to come against Lobos. Outside against the Lobos. The other outside against the Lobos. We're going to crush these guys. Wide receiver. That's a bend. We're hoping this guy is an offensive lineman. D tackle we're going to push all the way back here to the end of the year. Same thing with this corner because we may end up cutting them anyway. I don't want them coming in early and uh, saying yes. So, <sighs> Alright, let's look by position. So we needed a fullback and we got one. We need two wide receivers. We got a 74. We're looking for the 73. These guys are all extra, so I'm going to cut this guy. We only need one more. Cut him too. Oh, 
tight end. We needed one. <clears throat> Texas had a good visit, but we're still ahead. Plus, we just gave him 700, so we're fine there. We needed two tackles. We got him. We have him on the board, but we have an athlete that we think is an offensive lineman. That would be a good uh, tackle. Trying to get this guy. We need two guards. We already got the center. We're going to move him to guard. Need two defensive ends. We got this one. We're trying for this one. Need two D. I'm sorry, one D tackle. Really want this guy. He's just a backup. Linebackers. We only need one outside, one middle. So we're trying to get these two guys to fulfill outside and middle. And these guys are just on the board as extras. Um, same thing with this guy. Corners, we need two. We got a 71. Trying to get the 68. The 67 is a backup. And then the athlete, like I said, this guy, we think he's an offensive lineman. He's uh, 6'2", 279. Sounds like a senior or a center, center or a guard. As you can see on here, speed isn't very great. Hit power, play rack, tackle, pursuit. Looks like a D lineman, but I think he's going to have some blocking. That's not showing up on here. Let's go look and see what our classes are right now. We don't have a ton of people signed. We're at number 18. We did get a five star, five three stars. We're up to a three star school now, guys. It's defensive coordinator one before I forget. And we'll go with power and finesse moves to finish that off. Give our D-line some help. <clears throat> All right. Five and one. Let's go to our conference standings. Our schedule's not going to be great. We're not going to be competing for a natty at all, but we should be able to win the conference. So we're 3-0 and in the conference. Um, haven't played anybody in our division yet. Been playing all these other guys in the West. I think Scott Frost should be fired. Um, I don't follow Big Ten well enough. Um, somebody was talking on Twitter yesterday. He probably should have stayed at Central Florida, but I don't know. They uh, they are definitely not the team that I grew up watching kill us. <laughs> wow, look how bad this, this half is. What's our championship contender look like? All right, we're at 70 right now, but next year it says we have the second best roster and the first best for those. So we got to win the conference this year and then we're competing for a natty the next three years. Buckeye, yeah. I'm a Mizzou fan, so uh, Honest, we should have gone to the Big Ten instead of Nebraska, just based on how close we are to Illinois and um, Northwestern and um, the academics and stuff. Probably would have been a better fit for us than the SEC. Read up with the gift. Hey, thanks, man. Thanks for the gift sub. Appreciate that. Let's get this bye week done. See if anybody uh, commits while we're sitting here waiting to play. Frank the Tank, welcome in, man. How you doing? We are uh, five and one at Northern Colorado this year. We just uh, we just went into the. Uh, the uh, championship contenders page and it said we're ranked 70 right now but next year we're, we'll have the second best team in the next two years after that first number one best team so we should uh, be able to do some damage after this season yeah we used to play Illinois every year and we used to like travel to each other's school and then they started playing um, in St. Louis at both Bush Stadium and at the Dome and then they stopped that for whatever reason I don't know we used to, and we also used to play Kansas at uh, um, Arrowhead, and we stopped doing that when we left and went to the SEC. Thumbs hurting. Welcome in, man. How's the wrist? It's it's hurting today, and I took a pain pill. So 
It's just um, one of those things, man. It could be weather. It could be uh, with this uh, hurricane down there and moving up this way that's changing the, uh, the pressure in our part of the town. So who knows? I like pre-medicated and took a, a pain med beforehand. I hadn't had one since, um, I think I took one when we first got home and I hadn't had one since. Um, been uh, been drinking tequila and uh, wine instead of taking the pain meds, but I was like, ah, I'm gonna take one today. I'm gonna be on here for a while and this is gonna hurt like hell, so. All right. I gotta look and see if we have any more visits, but we should have the D tackle, we should have the outside, that outside, that wide receiver, that D end. Um, we're in a recruiting battle with this guy. I think LSU and Texas are gonna try and fuck us here. So that hopefully that goes to the offseason and we don't get a uh, insta commit out of these guys. Um, in fact, you know what? We should go look at tight ends and see if there's anybody out there. So uh, we have some, we have a few weeks that we can put uh, points on them because uh, we have extra points we could spend, right? Some of those guys don't need 700. Oh. Rams fan went in St. Louis or Chiefs fan? I was a. Uh, Rams fan while well, they're here. Um, I was a Broncos fan before that, so it was weird being a, uh, a Broncos and Rams fan. Um, so when they would play each other head to head, I would root for the Rams just because it was our team. But as soon as they left, I went back to being a full time Broncos fan. Um, I still think we're making the wrong decision playing Teddy Bridgewater. They ought to be playing. Uh, they ought to be playing Locke until he's, he proves he's absolute trash. I mean, he's... Right, he's 38%. Let's look at this guy. We're not taking a 50-year-old tight end. I just won't take a tight end. I'll just go with three next year because we would have a senior, a sophomore, and a freshman, so... <laughs> Raiders fan, yeah. God, a four nine forty. Jesus, I think I can run a four nine forty even with a bad ankle. I am not putting this guy on my team. We're just gonna have to hope we get that guy. I'll tell you what, we'll do. Let's look at wide receivers. Sort by squat, because I want strong guys, right? And look for anybody that's big. 63190. 6'5. 6'5, 2'11. Can move him to tight end. Runs a 4'4. Four, four. Can't block where the shit, I'm sure. <laughs> I can imagine. Take 50 off him and scout him first. 67. It's not going to be worth a shit. How strong is he? 52. Eh. Six foot 190, 6'2, 5'11. Alright. I'll leave Brent, uh, I'm sorry, Brett Graham on there just as a. Uh, Possible. I don't need this 67 overall. That'll make sure I don't get him confused. <clears throat> All right. And I send before every every game. I'm sorry, I save before every game. Um, I don't like using autosave because it'll cause the uh, PlayStation to lock up at the end of the game sometimes. So I uh, 
have to manually save, but I had the power blink out in me in the middle of a stream the other day. And I only had 30 minutes to go and had to bust it up into two different VODs, but um, it was one of those where the storm knocks the power out before you ever hear the thunder. It was really kind of strange. We should stop these guys. I said these guys are only uh, half hour. I'm sorry, an hour away. Whatever reason, they're uh, they only have one helmet. Let's give them the brown shoes, the shit shoes. Go to coach mode and go from here. What time is it? 3.30. Gotta pick up the pace. We gotta win this game. Hopefully we play some other crappy ass teams in conference and we can do some faster simming on this because it's it's taking too long and uh, I want to get through some of these, get these recruits in. We're going to have a bowl game. Averaging 41 points a game in the sim. All right, so Ingram's probable, so that means he probably won't play. They have uh, two guys out. All right, give us the ball. Let's go. First play, going deep. It's not four verse, but we're going deep. That's the way to start the game. <clears throat> right up the gut for 29 yards. You want to cover the middle of the field? <clears throat> These guys are only 77 overall, so this should be a slaughter. Hey, V-Dub, our first game of the season, we beat uh, East Carolina, who had beat us in a bowl game to end the last season. We beat them... 62 to nothing. <laughs> it was it was ugly. We, we had over 700 yards of offense through for over 500. That was in the sim. There you go. Move the chains. Harrington with the tackle at the 33 yard line. First down. All right. This corner halfback read I've yet to see him scramble out of this play, which is good because he scrambles a little too much for my taste. There we go. Nice dot. Love that out pass. All right, let's run this inside zone. <clears throat> Right up the middle. There you go. All right, Eric. Ingram is playing. So, probable. Probable does mean play. So that works for me. And let's do a dive here. If we can get this down to the one, I'll run a uh, pullback dive for George. Oh, he's just going to run him over. Just steamroll that safety. this game gets ugly fast I do from fast sim see what happens ah, fourth and two and he dropped it go boys damn gotta hold their hand
There we go. Strike right down the middle of the field. They're killing him down the middle. I'm going to throw more passes down the middle. He's a move around in the pocket, not just bail. He had a halfback right there to dunk, dump it off to, right over the middle too. Throw it. There you go. Third and eight. We haven't called this one all day. There you go, Jimmy sticking out on third and two. See if we can hit him down the middle. Boom! Touchdown! Come on, Sim. Fuck. And we keep going for it on fourth down. Fuck this. Here we go. Four verts. It's three big plays right up the middle of the field. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Look how fast he is. Look at that. First of all, he picked it off. And then he outruns my uh, wide receivers. What the fuck? Man, we cannot do shit right now in the sim. Get up. Get up. That makes it first and ten. <laughs> Let's go. Alright, this is the play we started the game with. This deep attack right down the middle. We've already gashed them three times right down the middle of the field with passes, so.
Make that four. <laughs> yeah, your friend delivered. <laughs> That's pretty funny. 66-35. Who'd you place back to? There you go. Out of bounds. Thank you. UNLV. Hey, V-Dub, that's, that's better than uh, being on Tinder and ending up hooking up with your own girlfriend or wife. Launch that one away. All right. We should be crushing these guys. Go, boys. Four down territory. There we go. Call it a gain of seven yards. That makes it first and ten. Larry, Larry, Larry. Mike 51, Mike 51. Good pass, good pass. Larry, knock it. That's funny. All right, let's try this slot drive again. We just need to uh, move the chains. I'll save that last time out in case we get sacked. On the ball, let's go. Huddle up, let's go. On the ball, get in there. Get 300 yards passing in the first half. All right, we got two slants coming here in the middle from the right. Boom, hit him. Hit him. Touchdown. There we go. Forty-one passing attempts in the first half. There you go, Nevada's leading UNLV in this one. All right, let's see if we can do anything in the sim. There we go. Touchdown. All right. Up by three scores. Four and out. Let's get another one. Down the field, down the field. Field goal works for me too. I got another touchdown. All right. Sim out the quarter. All right, they scored. Man, those third down conversions. There we go. A quarterback, 492 yards of offense.
Should get us another upgrade here. <clears throat> Should be enough points at the end of this game to get us. Yeah, maybe we maybe if we get some guys to commit, that'll push it over the top. Yeah. Like I said, kind of have to hold their hand. 471. So we threw for 523 yards, five touchdowns, one pick, one sack. Got our 100 yards rushing. Hayes went nuts. <laughs> oh. Another 18 pancakes. <laughs> I still can't believe we had 25 pancakes and only one sack allowed in that one game. That's just... Never, never, ever seen that. All right, anything... On this page of note, K-State beat Oklahoma State. There you go, Breezes. You guys lost to the Wildcats. All right, so we're 6-1 and one now. We've already uh, equaled our win total from last season. Let's go look at our conference standings and our uh, schedule so far, what we've done. I'm not 100% sure if I'm going to stream tomorrow day or not. I know Tuesday I'm not streaming at all. Tuesday I have a 10.30 in the morning doctor's appointment. And I also have a uh, football league that I've been a commissioner for the last 20 plus years. It's like 23 years. Um, we have our auction. We don't do a draft. We do an auction. Um, so um, Tuesday we won't be doing anything. And as possible, I might be sore from dealing with all that I may not do it Wednesday either so we'll try to get one done Monday um, yeah tight spot we're we're finally we're a 93 overall team so we should be six and one and the game we lost we we I think we lost by seven we should have won the game we kind of pissed it away at the end um, so I'll probably come back and and uh, do a stream on Thursday too all right we got one of those two stud linebackers the other one's ready to visit this week we got the other wide receiver, and we got a corner. So we got both corners. Let's get in here and look at our recruiting. We're finally uh, nailing down these guys. We only need six more guys, so let's move down here and put these guys in order. All right, this guy's going to move to guard. We got two corners. We got the fullback. We have one of the two tackles. Fourth pick in the first round. You have who are you figuring out who you're going to take? Um, got both wide receivers. Got one of the two DNs. We got one of the uh, one of the linebackers. So now we just need one linebacker, one D tackle. One D end. D, there's a D tackle, outside linebacker end. All right. Need the tight end. Need another tackle or guard. Need both of these guys, preferably. Not this guy. And we got our fullback. So a lot of these guys are not necessary anymore. We get both wide receivers? Yeah. So I'm going to leave Graham on there in case we need him for um, tight end. Just a... a Tall, fast, tight end that can't block where they should. Um, these guys are going away. That's our lead on this, on this linebacker. Saquon F4. Yeah, he's still tricky because you don't know with that injury and the offensive line. It's just hard to tell what he's going to be. This guy's going away. Middle linebackers going away. D tackle outside. We don't definitely don't need the 72 D tackle. 
Um, I'll leave the 73 just in case for somehow whatever we don't get this guy, but nobody else has even got an offer in for him, so we should be okay. And if for some reason he commits, we'll, uh, we'll get rid of him, but he, he doesn't even have a visit in there yet, so. These guys are all maxed out. I'm gonna, I'm gonna give him max points just to push him up the list in case we need him. give him points too. All right, let's get this visit scheduled. This tackle I don't really like. He will be immediately replaced next year. So, Henry of four would be a much better, much better, much safer. All right, let's go in here and look at our classes. We are 24th right now. That'll that'll change when we get some more of these guys committed. We really only want 15 guys, so we're not going to have a, a huge class. Hey, look! We went from having one A and now we have three A's. And some of the D's are up to C's now, so that's going to definitely help going into next year. We will, we will be able to uh, recruit the way I like to recruit next year. You guys saw my uh, Army Sim Dynasty uh, recruiting class that I showed last stream. Um, that's kind of what we're going to be like in two years. <clears throat> we won't take anybody on the team less than 75, basically. All right. So where are we at, contenders? Because we were, what, 70 before? Are we taking a big jump yet? All right, we're up to 50. So we will be ranked. We win the conference championship. We will definitely be ranked. So standings. Air Force, Northern Colorado, both six and one. We just crushed them. They're an 83. We're a 93. Their offense is 14 points less than us. <laughs> Let's just look at the entire Mountain West. It's kind of trash. <coughs> 61 times. Wow. Everybody uh, help me? Let's check that real quick. Yeah, he's, he's good. Top 25. We had a couple of upsets. Syracuse is number one. Coastal Carolina is two. Syracuse jumped over Coastal Carolina, Oklahoma, and Michigan. Wow. And they didn't even play. Look at that. They didn't play. These three teams won, and they all got jumped by Syracuse. How does that happen? How does that happen? We had a couple of four and three teams in there. We're getting shafted by our schedule. That's the problem. That's our job security. It should be safe now. Yeah, we're safe. We're going to get an extension. All right, New Mexico. We've got a bunch of guys visiting, so let's get in here and uh, kick their ass. Again. New Mexico's helmet's jacked up. Running running Central Florida's helmet. We'll give them Houston so it's at least in the, this it's at least in the same uh, color scheme. Hey Spectre, there was somebody who uh, I think he, he made a um, death penalty team. And he uh, moved moved all of his players, the punter, and cut them, so he would get all of these walk-ons. He was like a twenty-five overall team, and uh, it took him six seasons just to win a game. <laughs> he got fired like three times. He was he was posting on Reddit about it. All right, our defense needs to go nuts. 
That's what this says. And then they have a tight end with a broken hand. Hey, we're playing in the rain. In the rain at home. I'd rather see a snow game than a rain game. I'm so tired of these fucking rain games. Let's see if we can just straight sim this and do well. Nope. Gotta fucking hold their hand the entire game. Alright, we're gonna have to play offense next drive. <laughs> we're on our own one yard line, so let's not get a safety here. Yes, yeah, it's, it's uh I can't imagine trying to play with teams with that that low overall. Can you imagine run blocking and pass blocking? You would you would have to uh you would have to at least play on default. You might even have to play on uh, all American instead of Heisman. Third down. We're going to run it again. SD, yes. This is uh, a team builder on PS3. This is the college that I went to school at for a four year. God damn it. Fourth and inches. We're going for it. We are definitely going for it. On our own 11, we are going for this. This is the 49er George special right here. All right, lineman, block. There we go. We're on a 13 yard line. Let's go empty stick, see if we can hit one of these slants. Here we go. Boom. You got rid of that just in time. Yeah, Vincent Jackson did play here. Um, Ed McCaffrey, that is the uh, actual head coach. I made our head coach, Ed McCaffrey. And uh, his. Uh, Christian's younger brother, who went to Michigan, transferred to Northern Colorado, and he's their quarterback. Go read option. See if he can get loose. Here we go. Up the field. Why would you run up the middle? He had a clear lane outside. Just stay outside the tackle. He had a lot of room to run. Oh, man. Hit him right in the hands. I thought it was a fumble at first. All right, third and one. That's fine. Yard and a half, almost two. There you go, Ingram. Nice. So what do you guys think about uh, Baker Mayfield getting traded? Not Baker Mayfield. Fuck, the guy from Jacksonville. Um, Minshew getting traded to the Eagles. I don't know why I thought Baker Mayfield. There we go. Nice. Run him over. Get the first down. Yeah. I don't know why. 
I knew I, I could picture his face and I just said Baker for whatever reason it was a brain fart. Just an insurance policy, I guess. But uh, it was interesting, especially from Jacksonville's perspective to just go all in on Trevor Lawrence. I mean, you could keep Minshew, and if Lawrence shits the bed or gets hurt, then at least you have somebody who's uh, started and uh, had a little bit of success as your quarterback. There you go, up the field, nice. He didn't run out of bounds, thank God. We're going down the field now, 20 yards. Throw a little deeper, there we go, hitch corners. Stay on your feet. At least he didn't fumble. <clears throat> Ooh, what a hit. Boom, that was a shoulder right to the head. Damn, targeting anybody? Here we go, touchdown. I mean, they're all in on, on Trevor. Um, it's hard on these uh, the rookie QBs. To It takes a while to get used to the NFL speed and coverages and all that stuff. But you know, when I was growing up, they never started the first year. They always sat for at least one year, maybe two. Um, but they uh, spend so much money on these guys that you know, you gotta got to play them, and I understand that. But I would have kept Minshew as the backup for sure just to protect myself. I have no idea who their backup is now. Touchdown. Down the field. At least kick a field goal. Oh, we had to punt. Shit. Right. Oh, we're going to play this. 48 yards. Let's go play action deep in. <clears throat> see if we can hit these guys down the middle like we did last game. See if they're going to cover this play or not. Get out of bounds. Get the first down. I'm calling timeout. We don't have a whole lot of uh, wiggle room here, so... Let's go four verts and see if we get anything out of this. Chase has got to stop. God, quit scrambling. Throw the fucking ball away. We're wasting time running the ball. Throw it away. Yeah, Chase needs to clean up his drops or uh, he's not going to play a whole lot this year. they got other wide receivers that they can play and play to him. And there he goes again. Come on, mad scrambler. I know he's not going to scramble in this one. Probably should have called this on first or second down. There we go. Let's go. Get up there. We got one timeout. Get on the ball. One more pass. Call the exact same play. See if we can get us a, a field goal. Oh, what a dot. Out of bounds? Did he get out? Is it really going to stop? Good, they did call it out of bounds. Thank you. All right, let's see if we can hit one of these guys on a slant for a touchdown. 10, 88. Throw it. I'll take that. Nice drive.
All right, boys. Boom. <laughs> 76 yards to Wilson for a touchdown. Let's just sim the rest of this quarter. There's another one. Interception. Interception back. Punt. 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 <laughs> 42 to 7. We're just going to sim out the rest of the game. We got our backups in. Threw a pick. Threw another pick. Good throwing picks, Manning. We missed the field goal. 45 14. Oh, wow. That's terrible. Yeah, I was watching that tournament yesterday after the Cardinal game was over. <clears throat> All right, we got an upgrade. Let's check these stats real quick and move on. So we threw for almost 600 yards. <laughs> but we did throw three picks, two of them to the uh, backup. 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. Exactly 100 yards rushing. Wow. Look at these two guys balling out. Pancakes were a little more in check. We had a short stack of pancakes this time. I used to uh, cook in restaurants when I was in college. Worked at a Village Inn Pancake and uh, um, Country Kitchen. It's kind of like a Denny's. Yeah, Cardinals. We uh, we we were up seven to three the other night and gave up eight runs before we got an out in the uh, seventh inning. And then today, um, our closer came in and gave up a three-run walk-off. Or, yeah, three-run walk-off. So, yeah, Jimmy or JT, I love Village Inn pancakes are awesome. I love the um, the skillets they used to make, rolling those omelets out to look like a football. All right, I'm gonna put this here so we get all 15,000 points I think we'll only need to put one in the uh, the, the uh, um, the other one in this next top row and that'll open up insta commit so I don't need to worry about pipeline states too much all right let's advance Big, big game against the Air Force. We have to win that game or we're not going to win our division. Yeah, tight spot. I used to, uh, used to work at a, uh, a local place that it was a bar, but they had uh, burgers and pizza and shit like that. We had to make everything from scratch. And then uh, Country Kitchen and Village Inn. I also worked at TGI Fridays back in 1985. I remember which exactly what year it was because the Cardinals went to the World Series that year. I was living in Colorado. Um, that was fun. They make all of their salad dressings from scratch. Um, I made all the quiche. Their uh, mud slide pie. I made that. They take these chocolate cookies and you grind them up in a food processor and lay it out in this huge ass sheet pan. That's the crust. And then there's 27 scoops of coffee ice cream. And then you make this um, mixture of chocolate and egg whites and this other stuff. And it fills in around all of the uh, uh, scoops of ice cream. And then you put more and that becomes the, uh, the salad and then the, like fills in around the scoops. And then, yeah. And then we put more of the, uh, the chocolate cookie crumb on top. And then you throw it in the walk-in freezer for like two days. Look at that. We got five of the six we needed right there, guys. We need this tight end. We don't need this outside linebacker. We need this tight end. And I think 
it thinks this guy is a D tackle, but I'm going to try him at um, offensive line. We'll we'll look. I want to get him to commit, and then I'll cut him if I don't if he's not an offensive lineman. We'll. Uh, I still want to get that 66 tackle because we actually have to have an extra tackle, but he's going to get replaced next year, guaranteed. All right, 73 is going to go down here. 69 guard. Got both our guards. Yeah, it thinks this guy is a D tackle, but I think he's a he can play offensive line. We'll see. He might even be in the uh, 70s as an offensive lineman. All right, so now our class is really shaping up. Look at that. Yeah, I cook a lot at home too. Well, before this, I used to cook a lot. My dad taught me how to grill. He, he taught me how to cut up whole chickens. So instead of buying, you know, chicken breasts and this and that, he would buy whole chickens and we would cut them up and then grill them on a uh, Weber kettle grill too. Not even on a gas propane. All right, we do not need this guy at all. And I really need this guy to go to the offseason. If he goes to the offseason, we'll put 15,000 points on him and get him. Because they won't put any more than 10,000 on him. So this guy is only on here just in case. So um, I'm going to go ahead and give him a scholarship offer. Even though we're, we have no, no chance of him uh, getting a visit right now. Yeah. So he might get passed by those other two guys. So worst case is we only take uh, one tackle instead of two. We'll be fine because we'll still have five tackles on the on the roster. I was just trying to uh, get an extra guy, but that's okay. No big deal. We do need this tight end because we have a senior, a junior, a freshman, and a red shirt. So, all right, let's see where we are now because we were not anywhere near the top ten. And now we jumped all the way to five with that one week. So let's go in here. This is what we started out. Look at all these in 60s. All these guys. Look at these offensive linemen in the 50s. Defensive linemen and linebackers in the 50s. We were a 63 overall. We got the number 22 class. Next year, we jumped to 74. We got the number one class. Then we went to 79 with the number four class. Last year, we were in 86, and we only went six and seven. And we got the 13th class. Now this year, we're in 93 overall. So probably won't get, um, we probably won't stay in the top five with only 15 recruits, 16 recruits. But we should be able to stay top 10. Cantley and Deschambeau keep flopping first. But, uh, yeah, I was watching those guys yesterday. Cantley, uh, Cantley hurt himself on the 18 when he put that ball in the rough instead of keeping it in the middle of the fairway. Not a fan of DeChambeau. I think he's just kind of an arrogant prick, but he can hit the hell of a... Did you see that DeChambeau is going to go in the uh, longest drive competition? Hey, thank you. Thank you, man. So, we're out of here. save this we'll go look at some stats because we haven't looked at stats all day <clears throat> and look at our top 25 again we'll look at the contenders and see how close we are to getting ranked we definitely need to be ranked by the end of the year even if it's just barely in the top 25 because uh, of the schedule we'll uh, bump the schedule difficulty next year All right, so Syracuse, <laughs> they jumped everybody and then got beat by uh, Louisville and then dropped all the way to seven. So now Coastal Carolina is the only undefeated team. Wow, if we didn't have that loss, we might be ranked now. Conference standings, we should be uh, Air Force. We got to beat these guys. 
we'll jump to a four star. We'll jump to a four star school next year, so that that'll be uh, very helpful when it comes to recruiting. Um, now we're forty seven, so we'll definitely be in the top twenty five if we can win out. Stats. Look at that. We're number one in the nation passing. Even though he's kind of spastic, we are number one. <laughs> no, I put, uh, we are in the Mountain West. I put um, Hawaii in the Pac-12, put Colorado in the Big 12, put Nebraska in the Big 12, put Notre Dame in the Big 10. So once we uh, start competing for natties, I'll move us out of this conference and I'll put um, Hawaii back in this one, Colorado back in the Pac-12, and we'll go to the uh, Big, T Big 12. Nebraska will be our closest rival then. All right, so let's go look it up this way. So we have the number one passer, only six picks, 21 sacks. Look at this guy. So he threw for 3,200 yards last year as a redshirt freshman. So he's going to pass those marks this, this game right here. And here's his overall. 91 speed. His awareness is all the way up to 86. 88 throw power. This guy um, is not a... Uh, oh, damn it. I'm sorry. I do that all the time. Thank you. I do it all the time. Thanks for letting me know. So, this is the starting quarterback. <clears throat> um, this guy was recruited as an actual quarterback, not an athlete. I actually found an 89 speed, 89, 80, 89 speed, 87 throw power quarterback. That's a scrambler. So this has this is definitely not a uh, athlete moved. So so we're not going to have thousand yard running back with uh, this offense, but he's going to get a lot of touchdowns. Receiving yards are spread out too much. Um, we still have plenty of time for these guys to get to a thousand. These two guys, for sure, should be able to get there. Not sure about these two. It's just because we spread it so much. Look at those pancakes. Look at that. That guy, he had nine in one game earlier today. T Twenty TFLs by our D tackle. He's a junior. We have no sacks. We are not getting sacks. That's okay, we're winning. That's all I care about. Let's go save this and then uh, get on to the next game and get this uh, moving forward. It's, fuck, it's 4.30. Already been here for four and a half hours. I know some people that have done 24-hour streams and they're like, there's no way I could play NCAA for 24 hours. Um, I guarantee you I could do NCAA for 24 hours. I just don't know if I could sit for 24 hours. I might have to pull a jimmy and move my camera up on top of the TV and stand for some of it. But uh, I easily could do I easily could do NCAA for I could do a whole season and play the games, not stream them. <laughs> not not sim them. I could play a whole season. Yep. Alright, so Air Force, this is a huge game. Let's go back. I didn't look at our schedule. We need to go in here and look at the schedule. And then we're going to go play. All right. So we destroyed ECU. 62-0 in the sim. Then we lost. Lost by 12. Threw a late pick. And they scored. Should have won that game. And it's been kind of domination from that point on. So... Yeah, Mizzou, I'm not sure what we're going to be like this year. I mean, we we improved within the season last year, but COVID was such a, a, a mess on the entire season. But Drinkwitz is getting some guys to come in. He's, he's a younger coach, and he connects with these guys really well. Um, when they have their recruiting visits, he has a huge barbecue at his house. 
and uh, they got a pool and they all party and so the only problem with Missouri is it's out in a uh, bunch of cornfields right so what does Air Force have scheduled all right they have Wyoming New Mexico Colorado State we, we've got to win this game yeah no Bama well, JT, it is if you're coming from a city and <laughs> going out to the country. You're not used to all those cornfields, man. It does, doesn't bother me. Not too far from where I live, there's a bunch of cornfields down by the river. So I'm, I'm kind of used to it, but depends on where you're coming from. We, uh, so if we get moved to the other uh, division, have to play uh, Texas, Oklahoma, and Bama, or an LSU, good God, good luck. Yeah, we, we had a we had a car accident in, in uh, Kentucky in the middle of a cornfield. So All right. Let's get this game going. We're going to wear all blue. They're going to wear all white. Yep. Got them all white. Here we go. Southeast Missouri. I'm not sure why we're playing those guys. I know why we were playing played Missouri State last year because Missouri State's trying to build their uh, program up to. Uh, I don't know if they ever get to the point where they're D1, but they're they're trying to. Their head coach came from Mizzou. Um, Southeast is uh, not that great. I actually saw them two years ago. We went, um, there was a parents weekend at Mizzou, and it was against Southeast, and we just killed them. We sat behind uh, Southeast, behind Simo's uh, bench, and their quarterback was just, he was just a mess. He was so mad, we killed him. All right, so their quarterback is out five weeks. Their other quarterback is questionable. They have an outside linebacker out for the year and a wide receiver out three weeks. Yeah, they have they have a lot of other uh, Division One sports, but uh, they're not even close. Um, not this year. We're not going this year, uh, mostly because of this. And uh, I will be up there. I think we're going to Mizzou for my birthday on the eleventh. I was supposed to ref two matches up there that day, but I won't be doing that now. Um, but we'll go up there and have lunch and see my daughter. So, All right, guys. We need this win. We need a good game here. All right, we're going to go into the win so we have the win in the fourth quarter. And I send these kick returns because every once in a while you get one for a touchdown. All right, let's run the ball right now. USN, welcome in, man. How you doing? I'm on, I'm on. All right, snap the ball. Ooh, what a hit. USN, man, we're 7-1, and one, and this is uh, pretty much for the division in our conference. Um, so we got to win this game. Boom. See, he does not run out of the pocket. He will stay in the pocket and throw, even late with, with a guy in his face, just like that. I know if there's, if there's a... Uh, if there's a time in the game where I don't want him to run, that's going to be the play that we call. Nice. I also downloaded uh, North Dakota State. I was actually going to put North Dakota State in this conference too. Get rid of uh, New Mexico. Let's go deep. I also have Liberty. I wish they would let you add more teams and not just make you take teams away. Oh, did pick it? Oh, thank you. That was close. Oh, 
want to run the ball, but I don't like those plays. Let's do this uh, inside zone. Here we go. Cut it. Nice job. Guy does not get enough yards, but he's uh, exactly what we need. So just got to keep this guy healthy. Let's run another play. That would be cool. Yeah, those helmets are those helmets are a mess. Boy, somebody needs to learn to block these guys. Did he? That's cool. Yeah, I know they they kind of manhandled whoever they were playing. No, let's not. I don't use formations. I just second and twelve. Let's do this slot drive. See if we can connect over the middle. Get. Eight or ten yards. Hey, thanks for stopping by, T. Clink. Appreciate it, man. Have a good day, a good night at work. Go. Cut. This guy's got 90 speed. Look at him juke. Guess we're going to run for these 12 yards. Let's run this inside zone. If we're uh, fourth and one or fourth and inches, we'll go for it. Utah State Penitentiary. <laughs> Ooh, ouch! All right, we will. Uh, we'll just take our points because we got blasted on that play. There we go. Take our points. Unknown music, man. Hey, thanks for the raid. I appreciate that, man. I enjoyed uh, watching you guys make music last night. Appreciate that. And we kicked the ball off and they ran it back for a touchdown. Like I said, sometimes you get a touch, a kick return touchdown in the uh, sim. So <laughs> let's see if we can get one. See if we can respond. Nope. All right. Here, we'll throw some... Uh, Shoutouts in here. Snap the ball. All right, stick a nod for Jimmy right here. So we are seven and one, and playing Air Force, and Air Force is uh, our main competition for winning the division for our conference. So we uh, we need to win this game. We need uh, no EHEs going on here. We gotta we gotta win this game. Let's get second and six. Let's try this uh, play action. Iron Shadow, man, how you doing? Doing good. Streaming a little bit longer than I intended today, but we're having a lot of fun. I'm actually enjoying these uh, these sim games, and uh, oh, that was a bad play. Why would you throw that pass? Why? What's the point of that? That is a terrible choice. So, uh, trying to uh, win the conference and get into a bowl game for the second year in a row. A uh, bowl game second year in a row, not the conference. Oh, shit. Well, we uh, decided to shit the bed as soon as you guys showed up, so sorry about that. <laughs> All right, let's try this again. Let's try the stick play. Yeah, fields might be in quicker than week four. Throw it. Come on, boys. Got a block for him. Got a block. Let's go. All right. Let's see if we can cut this 16 yards in half, make it a more manageable third down. We got two guys going on slants across the middle. There we go. Yep, 
he loves to throw to that receiver on that play. So third and three is more uh, what we're looking for. What does coach want us to run? Here, let's do this. This is a play I know he's not going to bail on. So we'll see if he can connect for somebody for a first down. Let's go. Here we go. Nice. Let's try this H stick play. <clears throat> oh shit, he picked it. Come on. Come on. We got to win this game. We can't be turning the ball over. And we fumbled the punt and gave him a touchdown. Son of a bitch. Guys, guys, guys. We beat these guys last year. Nope, my team is the Broncos. I do like watching the Chiefs because they're uh, the closest team and that's who we get all the time. I do like watching Mahomes play. Um, but if Kansas City didn't have Mahomes, I, I would uh, not like them at all as a Broncos fan. Makes my uh, other Bronco fan friends upset with me that I actually like the Chiefs. But, yeah, well, Mahomes is good. I enjoy watching them play, man. But it's the Broncos. Let's get this guy in the slant. Right there. Hit him. Yep. First down. There we go. Yeah, this this will pretty much decide the division because we're five and zero and they're four and zero, and they don't have uh, they don't have anybody worth a crap left in their schedule. We still have Boise. Boise's in the other division, so there we go. Run him over. We're gonna have to uh, babysit this quarterback a little bit. Even though he's leading the nation in passing, he, uh, he tends to scramble a little too much, throws some untimely picks, so we do have a good running back. We just don't run the ball. I mean, we're air raid, so Shaq lost into Houston. They, they probably could use that pass rush after losing Clowney and Watts. Yeah, we're Broncos fans. All I can say is Teddy better win some games or I'm going to be yelling for Locke to come in. He's not going to get any better sitting on the bench. And he's got way more mobility. And a lot stronger arm. That offense just needs a quarterback. So if we could somehow steal uh, Aaron Rodgers, I would be ecstatic. Try this one. First down. Hold the ball. Good. Now we're going to run a couple plays. Get a little too pass happy here. We've got to run. Keep these guys honest. Cut. Push. All right, second and six is fine. Let's go. Go this deep curl. <clears throat> and he just threw it away. That's right. I know which play to call this time. Try this middle slant. Yeah, I like the Chargers too. I like Herbert. I like I like the team. I love the uniforms. There you go. Touchdown. Nice strike. Way to go. Set a school record for touchdown passes. 
Ain't no problem, Ty Spot. Hey, who knows, man? It's it's a quarter to five here right now, and uh, we still have several games to go. My wife's going to be like, when are you going to finish streaming? <laughs> so, you know, might, I might be here. We've been streaming for 4.47, so who knows? Hey, you never know. Three more hours. I did a seven-hour stream the other day. Stop these guys. Stop these guys. All right, they kicked the field goal, so we got two minutes to go. Shotgun pass. Let's try this hitch corners. Oh. Don't let him score. Come on, he just carried my offensive lineman for 10 yards. This fucking game. We're going all out on their uh, option. We're blitzing. We're playing aggressive. Strip the ball, big hits. We're going to try and disrupt these guys and uh, get a turnover right here. Get out there. Boom. Get him. There we go. Pushed him out of bounds. Well, Nina, sometimes they're, uh, they're great and sometimes they're not. <laughs> Been with the same one for 33 years. Some days she really liked to wring my neck, but she's only 5'1 and 115 pounds, so get out there. Get out there. What are you looking at? Alright, let's go. Get there. Nice. Hold him to a field goal. Still got plenty of time to score. Make it get it back to a one score game. Damn picks, man. Damn picks. Come on. Alright. Knew this wasn't gonna be an easy game, but um We gotta do better than this. Alright, shotgun pass. Let's go to the tight end post. <clears throat> Throw it. Throw it. There we go. Ooh, he stays in bounds. Big gain. Nice. Tight roping down the sidelines. Oh man. What are you measuring for? That'll make it second and long. <laughs> moving stuff. What are you moving? <laughs> Oh my goodness. Why are we running? Throw the ball. Come on. This guy runs entirely too much. Again. Saving those two timeouts. Alright, stick a nod. Let's go, Jimmy. This is your play, man. And he takes off again. I'm calling timeout just so I can call a different uh, formation. Lamar Jr. back here.
Level three, nice, yeah. Get out of bounds. Works. Save a timeout. Second down six. Let's run this smash. We're in field goal range, so no turnovers. Still got a timeout. Oh, and he dropped it. What a hit. Let's see what coach says we should run. I'd really like to see that one play. I can't I don't know what formation it's in. Let's go this vertical shake. See if we can get this guy open over the middle. There it is. First down. Get on the ball. On the ball. Let's go. Save this timeout for the field goal. And now we got to call timeout. I want to uh, take a shot at the end zone here. Do not scramble. Throw it. Shit. Get on the ball. Get on the ball. We're going to run out of time. What a terrible choice. Should have taken my field goal instead. Should have known better with this quarterback. When's the uh, FedEx Cup? The very last, the very last, uh, last tournament. Man, he's just gonna run for 100 yards today. that play where you know I know he doesn't uh, take off and run this one halfback corner read all right what is this formation see he never scrambles on that one I'm just going to keep calling it. See? He never scrambles. He stands in the pocket and throws. Every time. The read option. field. Thank you. Damn. Too much side to side. Yeah, when I was working for the fancy sports company, we had, um, so we had baseball, football, basketball, hockey. We had NASCAR and we had golf and uh, the golf, fantasy golf was, was one of the most competitive ones we had in the office league. Let's 
Yeah, well, I uh, I would have to buy a PS5 if they make it just uh, next gen. And not sure I will or not. So, and uh, it'll take a while to uh, do the research and figure out what works and doesn't work. All right, we can run the ball here. Oh, he dropped it. Damn. All right, we're going to go to the uh, the one that I know he's going to stay in the pocket for. I got to figure out what formation this is in. See? Touchdown. What a great play. That's a money fucking play. <laughs> I love the one button kicking. All you gotta do is hit X and he kicks it straight down the middle. <laughs> I don't have to I I don't have to move the thing back and forth, I just hit X. Alright, we need to stop. There we go. Run it till they stop it, right? There he goes. That's the first time I've seen him take off and run. And he had pressure up the middle, so I'm not surprised. He almost never runs that play. All right, let's try this middle slant, see if we can get half this yards, half or almost all. It's the second guy from the top. That's his favorite one to throw to on this play, right there. So they go into a playoff or they have somebody else behind them that has a chance to win. I have no idea what play I just audible to. Yeah, we'll go for that, fourth and inches. And we're off to the fourth quarter. Well, this game's been our hardest one all day. Even the UCF game we lost wasn't as uh, difficult as this one. We just made some mistakes on that one. Still going to call a dive, but I'm going to call a different play. There we go. Let's do this uh, play action deep out. There we go. Right at the sideline. Stay in bounds. Love that. Love that. Let's go read option these guys. out there and block for him. Take seven yards. That'll work. Yeah. I don't want to make a mistake down here, so we're going to run the ball a little more just to be uh, careful. We have a good running back and we can use him. Got our 100 yards rushing, so that's good.
Boom, touchdown. <laughs> School record for passing yards in the season as well. There we go. All right, we got the lead. Now we got to hold it. Got to hold it. We know if they score a touchdown, they're going to go for two. So look at San Jose State and Utah. All right, 546. Bumble, we got the ball. Uh, midfield. There we go. Let's burn some clock here. We need a touchdown, but we need to burn some clock while we're doing it. There we go. Oh, pick it up. Damn. All right, we got to turn on conservative carry here, guys. They're going for hit sticks. It says three yards, but it's three and a half. Look how far away that is. There we go. We're going to turn from uh, air raid to uh, ground and pound. We we're not going to we're not going to turn this ball over by throwing a pick. And I'm going to let the uh, clock tick down too. So. I might even put chew clock on because um, I'm not going to audible out of these. We're just going to run the plays. So it probably would be helpful. There we go. Dude is a beast. If we ever go to the read option, he will be a thousand yard running back for sure. Ah, that was a terrible block. Terrible block. That makes it second and ten. Boom. All right, he held on. Thank God. And they just let us score. So what are we up now? We're up seven, right? We're going for two. We're going for two. Two gives us a two score lead. You got it. What a stud. What a stud. Ooh, Vanderbilt just beat the shit out of Florida. Wow. <laughs> All right, nine point lead. And we get the ball back. All right, last time we ran this, I was messing around doing shout outs and we got a 60 yard touchdown on this. Ooh, he got lit the fuck up on that one. All 
All right, they're out of timeouts. Yeah, it'd be nice if they uh, they had a lot of really cool stuff. But I don't know what they're gonna. I have no idea. I just I just want their recruiting to not be like Madden's um, scouting <laughs> for the draft. I mean, if they just left this this, if they left the recruiting exactly like it is now, I'd be perfectly happy. let this clock go all the way down. We're going to take a delay a game and then we're going to punt. There's a flag on the field. Delay game, offense. offense. Delay game, offense. Still fourth down. Hey, we didn't fumble the snap. <laughs> All right. Had to babysit them, but they came back and won this game, so. All right. That should pretty much clinch the, uh, the division. Because even if we tied with Air Force, we beat them head-to-head, -head, so. That should get us in the conference title game against one of those other crappy teams. All right, so we're at uh, 300, 312 yards, six sacks allowed. That sucked. Got over 130 yards rushing. So we gave up some of the uh, passing to chew the clock at the end there. That's fine. Yeah, hey, Nina, actually, I found Tiger Woods, um, 2000 whatever. For the PC, I, I used to play it on a computer, and I just found it. I was looking for, uh, I was looking for Madden Eight, whatever Madden one that has Ray Lewis on the front. I was looking for that because I have that on my computer. Um, thank you, thank you. I was looking to uh, reinstall it on my computer, and uh, I can't stream and play off my PC. I don't have a good enough PC to do both at the same time. But I was looking to. At least play some of the old uh, old Madden. I can't find it. It's somewhere. Might be mixed in with uh, some DVDs, or I could have gotten rid of it. Who knows? It hurts. Right, that was a huge win. These next two should be much easier. We're gonna go faster on those in five hours. I started streaming right at noon, so. Tiger Woods, the Masters, yeah. We were at a, when we went to the Smoky Mountains, they had these, uh, um, the hell? Flea market type thing, it was a really big one. And so I, and they had a big, huge indoor facility and then they had all the tables outside. So I was digging through trying to find anything in CAA, especially uh, 13 or 14. If I could find 14 and, you know, pay 10 bucks for them. <laughs> I mean, I, I have my copy locked up in a safe so I don't have to worry about it, but uh, at least could sell it. All right, we're still number one. They're slowly creeping. They're gonna be number one next week. We're gonna drop to number two. So that's just gonna to go to the off season.
and we dropped to number six. So I would imagine we're gonna drop out of the top 10. That's okay. Yeah, I put a thousand hours into Madden 20. I actually did a, uh, I actually did a, uh, what is it, 30 years, 60 years, whatever it is, the most you can do as a head coach or as an owner in Madden. I did that with the Dolphins. Um, 13 is completely different. I actually installed 13 on my PS3 and was messing with it the other day, thinking, you know, should I play this and show you guys how this works? Um, and I can't tell you how much I forgot on recruiting on that game. <laughs> It's completely different. If you're a small school, there's no such thing as recruiting uh, four and five star players in low lock. You, you have to improve your uh, star ranking as your team, your level, to go get those guys. And you're, you'll, you'll be stuck uh, going after three stars and lower until you get to be a four or five star school. Check these polls real quick. So Coastal dropped. Wow. They dropped a lot. <laughs> they lost to Troy. <laughs> LSU is 7-2 and two and they're number one. What is this shit? Why are we not ranked? We have one loss. Why are we not ranked? Wow. All right, Michigan's number one with 8-1. Michigan, look at Cal. Syracuse. What a mess. What a mess. All right. All right, so we're 3-0 in the division. No one else even has two wins. 6-0 in a conference. And look at these guys. He's probably going to play San Diego State. Yeah, I did some gameplay with their team. It didn't feel that much different. I was uh, playing on the lower camera too. I uh, started one with, as Ohio State because I wanted to be able to recruit players and not be uh, hamstrung by being a low overall team. But uh, I'm going to have to play a whole lot more of that game to remember what I forgot. I'm afraid to fast sim in this game. I really am. We should be crushing these teams. They're a 91 overall. We would lose. This, this is NC State. Wow. I forgot I put them on there. This will be a tough game. But it's a non-conference game, so it won't matter. Yeah, I remember playing, I played <clears throat> 13 a lot. I played 12. I actually gave my 12 copy away. Um, and I played a lot of 13, and when 14 came out, I did not like the recruiting at all. I mean, th 13 is not easy, and it takes a while to get used to doing it and getting good at it. Um, and then it took me a long time to get used to recruiting on this and wa you know, watching videos on YouTube and reading posts. I don't even think I was on Reddit back then. I think it was Operation Sports is what I was looking. But um, once I once I figured out how to uh, recruit, then it became pretty easy. Let's go, Eagles. Hey, welcome back, man. Yeah, we're talking about 13, difference in recruiting and stuff. What's up, Ropes? So we have a tough non-conference game here. So maybe once I uh, going against the wind, yeah. Maybe once I uh, get used to the recruiting again, maybe I'll uh, crank up a uh, a thirteen dynasty and let you guys see how that works. Walk you through it. We're gonna go regular sim and just see what happens. Touchdown! All right, can defense play? 
And it's tied. And another touchdown. There we go. All right, let's get in and do some gameplay. All right, so we'll do this regular play so that it shows up in recent whenever I need it. <clears throat> yeah, these uniforms are awesome. Uh, Revamp was looking for a new school to go play at, and I think he was uh, he was at Marshall, and I was like, dude, you got to go look. You got to go look at NC State. Their their helmet logo is fire, and the rest of the uniforms you have a ton of options. And uh, so he went and checked it out, and he's like, oh, hell yeah. So he switched and went to this school. Um, yeah, I, I thought about going to them um, when I did uh, Central Florida. This will probably get us nothing. Doing read option with the quarterback and probably run into his offensive lineman here. Oh, look. Right at the gut. Yeah, we. Uh, I'm going to tell you guys right now, I'm not doing any uh, player redemptions for this series. We're just simming and having fun, and this is my old school. Um, so we'll, we'll get back to uh, the named players for... Uh, Central Florida and whenever we leave there and go somewhere else. Uh, we're just going to keep this one clean and, and just have fun playing in the sim and uh, recruiting and stuff. So just let you know. So I don't want you redeeming points and then not being on the team. I'm not going to even worry about it with this one. Here we go. Down the middle. Go, 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 go. Yep. I don't know. I'm not sure if they'll do any more updating of the schools they've already done or not. Um, Mizzou has changed their uniforms again. I kind of miss one of the uh, old uniforms that they had in the regular NCAA 14, the yellow ones with the tiger stripes on the shoulders. Um, I absolutely hate Mizzou's yellow helmet with the block M on the side of it. I really miss the uh, the black ones with the uh, the black ones with the uh, yellow tiger face. My uh, hold on a sec. My uh, earbud just died. There we go. Got like that, Carrie. Yeah, I, I could see uh, EA making those uh, all that stuff. Um, DLC that you have to pay for, which is what they did in the old 14, because I bought every DLC for the uniforms, and uh, also bought the uh, time-saving DLC, so I know how many points everybody's putting on their players. I don't, I don't use it. I use it to like show you guys my math is correct. But there we go. Do you score? Oh man, how is that not a score? Well, that's pretty focused recruiting. Yeah, I, I bought them all, but they were only like fifteen dollars. They were they were not expensive. Fifteen bucks for a bunch of uniforms that you're going to use forever. But I lost them all when we went to the revamp. I, I don't know if they'll show back up again if I uh, played it non-revamped. Yeah, on fourteen they had uniform DLC and they had time saver DLC, so you can see how many points the other teams are putting on. Um, We're going to go for two because I uh, wasn't paying attention. I'll call timeout and kick. Um, At least that was in the second quarter, not the second half, when I jacked that up. Oh, Jay Cougars with the raid. Thank you. Appreciate that, man. Welcome in, guys. Welcome in. 
Um, for this, I don't know. For I mean, I've never done one 60 years. Touchdown. All right, we're up two scores. Welcome in, guys. We are uh, playing Season 5 of our Northern Colorado Team Builder. So uh, welcome in, welcome in. We only have one loss in the season, so we're, we're trying to get through, win our conference championship, and get a good bowl game here. All right, only up uh, one score. Go, get down there. Touchdown. Answered back. All right. We're going to run the ball. What's up, Laprell? You guys staying safe down there? Yeah, North Carolina, yeah. I know that hurricane just uh, rolled on land, didn't it? Um, it's okay. Some days it feels good, some days it hurts a lot. It's been bothering me all day, even though I took uh, pain meds. So, get up the field. There we go. Um, we get uh, next round of x-rays on Tuesday, so hopefully they'll give me some uh, some good news on that. Uh, Wednesday will be three weeks from the accident. Um, on this, it's six to eight weeks minimum. It was non-displaced. So uh, I didn't have to have uh, plate and screws. Oh, this? Yeah, we had a car accident back on August 11th. We were going to the Smoky Mountains, and uh, we tried to pass a semi on a uh, small two-lane rural highway, and the uh, fucker ran us off the road. So we totaled our car, and I broke both bones in my wrist, uh, my fo both forearm. I chip fractured this bone, and then a complete break on this one. Try this Y cross. So, yeah. And the first words I so I ran up to him once we saw everybody was okay in the car. I ran up the road and was yelling at him. You know, Why would you do that? Why would you do that? And he didn't ask if we were okay. He didn't ask if anybody was hurt. He said, uh, well, "You're in no passing zone." That's the uh, that's the first. First thing out of his mouth was, you were in no passing zone. I was like, fuck you, no we weren't. We were clearly in a passing zone, and I have photographs to show we were in a passing zone. So. Now we're up, once we get up three scores, then I'll slow it down, but I want to I wanna score. We're running air raids, so we don't do anything slow. There we go. Yeah, there was, there was two things that happened that was very fortunate for us. If I was driving, we probably would have rolled because I would have gunned it and he would have clipped us. Um, and that would not have been good. And um, if he had broken my left wrist instead of my right wrist, we probably would have fought. But I knew as soon as I saw my wrist was broken, like, yeah, we're not going to fight. I'm just going to yell at this guy. Um, Kentu uh, yeah, Kentucky's a no-fault state, so our insurance had to pay for it. But uh, we are working with a uh, personal injury lawyer to see if we can uh, sue this guy. <clears throat> he better not have any uh, bad marks show up on his driving record. <laughs> go, get out there. Go, 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 go. Run him over. Oh, and he fumbled. Son of a bitch. On the ground. Damn it. Nah, I don't hit too well with my left hand, so uh, I would have had to kick him in the head. <laughs> oh my god, instant touchdown. 72 yards. Shit. All right. Yeah, this guy is, uh, he doesn't do TV commercials. He's a little more, uh, he's a little bit more, uh, 
reputable, put it that way. Is this play still in a recent plays? Yes. A low budget, are they? They're they're not low budget. But if if he doesn't think there's going to be a case, then uh, we don't have to pay him anything. Even if it's like six months down the road, uh, we won't have to pay him. But if uh, if we go and we win, then he uh, gets a third. So it's in his best interest to win a lot. <laughs> All right, let's go. Up the field. Go. There we go. We're going to run. Don't fumble, boys. Just don't fumble. All right, let's try this tight end angle play. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, I'm. I am definitely out um, for my entire college fall season. That's 15 games. Um, high school, I still might get some matches, so we'll see. Eight weeks would be the middle of October, and their season ends at the end of October, beginning of November. So, um. Throwing dimes out here. Look at that. All right, let's start making them burn timeouts just in case they have to kick a field goal. Look at this running back. What a stud. Here goes one timeout. Got our 100 yards. Yeah, I do high school, club, and college. And there are some girls that I've refed in all three, high school, club, and college. Good, he didn't get the first down. I love it when it's third and inches because that makes him burn another timeout. He just ran him all the way into the end zone. <laughs> there we go. Just shoved that safety all the way back. And then he's talking smack to him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, puss boy, get some strength on you, man. All right, they have less than two minutes with one timeout to get two touchdowns. Yep, they got one. <laughs> Look at that. 26 yards, 26 yards, 23 yards. Like nobody's business, right? They only have one timeout left. Let's do this halfback slam. We'll burn their last timeout. There we go. We're going to do something unconventional. They're going to play the run, and we're going to throw the ball. It's as good as a run right there. It's like an eight-yard run. And they have no more timeouts. Let's get this under 30 seconds. It should be the last play of the game. There we go. Fourth and one. Game over, boys. I'm not going to call another play. 
We are not going to turn the ball over. Oh, you want me to kick a field goal? All right, we'll kick field goal. Game over. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Beat NC State. Means we can handle these 93 overall teams because they were the same level as we are, so. All right. Yeah, one of these times I'd like to play as North Carolina, so now that uh, revamp is no longer there, I, I might be able to go play play as them down the road. We're just going to stay at Northern Colorado um, until I can actually do gameplay again. So however many years we get in, we'll get in. So 430 with three touchdowns, three sacks. We got our 100 yards rushing. Almost had three guys with 100 yards. Oh, we didn't get a lot of pancakes that game. All right. <clears throat> so let's see if that'll get us ranked because we actually beat a tough team. That should that should get us closer to the top 25. Oh yeah, ropes. Every episode in this dynasty, every every vod is going to be a full season. So we'll play. We have uh, two more regular season games, conference championship, and a bowl. So we have four more games to go. Um, these next two games, actually the the next game, we play Colorado State. This next game, we'll do a lot more fast simming, but I'll do it inside the game because I don't trust the uh, advance the week fast simming. So we'll go into the game and, and uh, let the game play fast in there until we need to step in and call plays. Um, Boise will kind of play it fast until it, we see if we need to or not, and then we'll jump in if needed. Um, so. No, she knows. She knows. The only problem is going to be when it rolls into dinner time. <laughs> It's already 5.30. So. I'll pretty much tell her just eat without me. Whatever you make, just make me a plate and I'll eat when I'm done. <sighs> yeah, five and a half hours. I did a seven hour one. We'll probably break seven hours today for sure. ready it's probably this wide receiver I'm gonna go ahead and, and uh, go after this guy even if we get him I'll, I can just cut him the only reason why I have him on the board is in case we don't get this tight end um, Ooh, LSU dropped out so it's just us in Texas so they're, they're only gaining a little bit every week so um, be nice to finish this guy off worst case is we give him 10,000 him 5,000 we're done so, <clears throat> we probably lost ground again on the top classes. Yeah, we're down to eight. We were up to four at one point, but we don't need a lot. So, you know, as you can see, I've only got three guys on the board, and we've had three guys on the board for like three weeks. So, let's save this real quick. But we'll finish this off today. I don't want to carry it over. I, won't, I probably won't show you the offseason where we finish the recruiting and do the uh, position changes and all the cuts and all that stuff. I'll just do that off stream tonight. Uh, but I'll get it all set up so that um, tomorrow morning we can start up again, probably around 10, 10, 11 central. Get another season in. I think she has to work in the office, so she'll be gone all day and it won't matter anyway. And then I'll be out until Thursday. I won't stream Tuesday, probably won't Wednesday. So let's check this top 25 real quick.
ECS. So Michigan, LSU, South Carolina, UCLA, Syracuse. Are we in here yet? No. All right, let's look at our conference standings. We're 6-0, and Air Force is 5-1, and but they lost to us, so... The other half is trash. Um, championship contenders. This will tell us what we're ranked at. And we are up to 33. So we're really ranked 33. So we should be able to get in the top 25 by the end of the year. And it tells us we have the second best and then the best and the best roster for the next three years. So we'll be uh, upping the schedule and uh, we'll be ranked pretty much from here on out. Alright, this, this game will go faster, a lot faster. The only way it won't is if we shit the bed and start losing by, you know, two or three touchdowns in the first half, and then we'll have to start doing work. <clears throat> Let's go. So we have uh, the most yards, the most pass yards, second most points, and the fewest rush yards allowed. Wow. Choke? Is he choking? Alright. As I've said, these two schools are separated by a half hour drive, so... Very close. I, went, I actually uh, visited uh, Colorado State, but really didn't like the campus too much. And Northern Colorado is a little bit smaller school. All right, we're going to get the ball first, or they want it? Touchdown. There we go. Love that. And they get a field goal. We'll trade touchdowns for field goals. And there's a punt. Go defense. There we go. There's another touchdown. Boom. 63 yards to Hayes. All right. Set a school record for receiving touchdowns in a season. And another one. This one to Wilson, 47 yards. This game's getting out of hand. Just do the rest of the half. Another touchdown before half. Gotta love that. 35 to 3. Let's just send the whole quarter. Another touchdown. And another one. <laughs> 49 to 10. And it's 56 to 10. I'll just do the rest of the game. Told you this was going to go faster. Touchdown. 56 17. 63 17. Going to get another one? Nope. 63 17. And I get an upgrade. Gotta love that. Alright, let's see what the damage was on the stats. <laughs> we almost threw for 600 yards. Walton threw eight touchdowns. Eight. We threw nine in the game. He threw eight. Good God. <laughs> 200. Nine catches for 204 and three touchdowns. Six for 98. Six for 127. Holy shit. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18 pancakes. It's not as, 
It's not as good as our 25 pancakes earlier in the day, but this dude is a pancake machine. <laughs> wow. Air Raid works, guys. It really likes it in the sim once you get the players. <laughs> Hold on a sec. Yeah. Oh, at least an hour. Yeah, I'm not done. You want to eat without me? Go for it. Seriously. All right. Save that. <laughs> yeah, that got a look. That got a... Wow, what the fuck look? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's just the two of us. All of our kids are moved out, so... Advanced the week. I mean, if I advanced the week. Yeah, UCLA getting a vote. Not in here yet. No, it wasn't that at all. It wasn't that look. I've seen that before. We gotta advance. It was a year freaking crazy look. <laughs> we'll try and get this done in less than an hour. I don't know. We still got three games to play, so. That's what happens when you do these, um, when we call the plays. Let's see what uh, Arizona, uh, Arizona, let's see what Air Force did. Because if they can't catch us, I'll just sim that Boise State game really fast. So it's only two games. It'd still be an hour. If I have to do two games, it's going to be an hour. Can't get away with that stuff when your wife's in her 20s, man. Come on, let's go. Can't do much else right now, ropes. Can't work. Got an ankle, elbow, and wrist. I can't do any, much of anything, so... battle with the last two guys we need. We're a coach of the year finalist. Shocker. Alright, we just gotta make sure we don't uh, fall out of this race because we do not have lockpick. Pretty much, not everything, but I do a lot. So this kind of sucks right now, I'm not doing it. Um, let's see, here we're gonna look here. We're gonna look at conference standings. Conference standings say, even if we lost, Air Force couldn't beat us because we beat them head to head and it wouldn't help Boise. So we're going to play San Diego State. So let's uh, cross our fingers and do a fast sim on this game just to appease the wife a little bit. And we're up to 34. Man, they're just not giving us any credit at all. These assholes don't want us in the top 25. What do they, what do they want? All right. Here we go. Cross your fingers. We lost. <laughs> 
No, I just do volleyball year round. I don't do it in the summer, but I do it the rest of the year. So basically from uh, August to May. Yeah, you can tell it to uh, sim the entire game inside the game. So as I probably should have done, but I was just curious how it would do um, in this fast sim. Because this is the first time we've done that all day is this fast sim, and then we lose 38-28. So now we're 10-2. and two. Oh, in the spring? Spring. So from like January until May, I do club. That's all on the weekends, Saturdays and Sundays. And um, from like March through middle of May, I do high school during the week, during the day, or, you know, after school's out. Um, that's boys. Boys volleyball. We got the wide receiver I don't need. And um, I also have uh, men's college in the spring, too. And that, that could be any day of the week. All right, so we're not going to get ranked now that we lost that game. So where does it knock us down to? 45. Yeah, we're not getting in the top 25. ECS guys can suck my dick. All right, so let's go and look at the conference standings. Because we lost, but we beat Air Force, so there's no reason Air Force should be ahead of us. Yeah, Look at that, we scored 510 points. Yeah, boys are in the spring, uh, women are in the fall, girls are in the fall. And then they both play in the winter for club. So starting like late November all the way into May or June if they go to nationals, um, the girls and boys club seasons play. advance the week get to our conference championship game <sighs> yeah, this is like my sixth sixth year of uh, high school and club it's only my uh, second year of college I did one in 2020, um, a little bit, and then because of, of the COVID stuff. So 19 was really my first year. Last year was just kind of a, eh. This was gonna be my uh, second full year. It was, it was really wild because of COVID. Um, they canceled a lot of the matches for the girls, um, high school and college in the fall but not all of them. So we had a few high school, a few college. Um, did that guy commit? Did we lose out on the guy? I think that guard committed. Where'd he go? He's just gone. That tackle. The tackle that was on here is gone. The fuck. He just disappeared. He's gone. Well, here, I'll make you famous. How about that? Go fuck yourself. And, uh, no. Alright, so. Let's save this. <laughs> that, that offensive lineman just disappeared. Flat out left. Gone. <laughs> Tishy and Bo should just give up. Maybe you should start. Maybe you should, uh. Do like uh, Chevy Chase and, and uh, Caddyshack, and just uh, lay down on the on the on the green and uh, putt it like he's playing billiards. Close to another upgrade. Yes, I'm close to another upgrade. So we'll get another one before the end of the year. All right. So this is going to be. Uh, Inside the game, semi-fast, semi-slow. Uh. 
All right, boys. <sighs> Any of you guys who have been in here for f almost six hours, um, as Param says, you're the real heroes. You're the real, real, real chump, stud, whatever. <laughs> Do I have that? I still have that. Hey, Jimmy. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Do I, have, I think I still have this. This is JT. I don't know if JT's heard this either. Here you go. Hey! Is this heaven? No. It's Iowa. Oh, man. The game came on. It says, no, it's Iowa. And for those of you guys that haven't seen this before, you can also uh, go to my Discord. Now, oh, Jimmy likes this one too. Hold on, let this music go away. There you go. So, do some fast sim until we actually have to play. Boom, touchdown. That works. Yeah, I grew up watching Chevy Chase on uh, Saturday Night Live. That tells you how old I am. Get in there. Get in there. Yes. Mr. Extra Point, though. Damn it. Here we go. Twenty to nothing. Jeez, they punt, we fumble, and they get a field goal out of it. And we got a touchdown. Twenty-four point lead. Get in there. Touchdown. There we go. This is pretty much how this is going to go from here on out until I leave this conference. So let's just show them what they're in for. Here, this is what San Diego State's head coach is saying right now. Yeah, I don't have the uh, commands thing set up, Rups, so. All right, 48 to 17. Let's just go. We're going to go to the end of the game. And our second string is eating them up, too. <laughs> 69 to 24. <laughs> we almost got our upgrade in this game alone. Here, what's the over-under on how many pass yards we had? I say 750. Oh, it was under. It was only 547. <laughs> we lost to Boise because we did the fast sim instead of this sim. Look at our backup quarterback had a 57-yard touchdown run. How many pancakes? <laughs> oh, my God. 10, 20. We had 26. We had 26 pancakes. <laughs> oh, my God.
Yeah, you don't don't sim off the uh, menu. S go in the game and sim. Now I will tell you that the uh, Army Dynasty that I've, I'm doing, that I have a hundred straight sim wins, is all from the from the sim from the uh, menu. None of those games that I go in and sim it from there. They're all right off the menu page. Yeah, we gotta we gotta crank those sounds up somehow. Let's advance this week. We're going to the Vegas Bowl. What else do I have? Oh yeah, this one. And then for all you Ric Flair, that one, that one's really low. I don't know how to get that one turned up. I know JT would like that one. All right. The nature boy. <clears throat> I do have an audio uh, editing thing that I installed, so I might be able to pull that in and push that up. So the uh, quarterback at South Carolina wins the Heisman by four votes over the running back at Arizona. All right, we're going to play uh, UCLA in the Las Vegas Bowl. All right, so our middle linebacker won the bed, Narek. And the butt kiss. I didn't win the coach of the year, though. All right, now we can attack the Sabin factor next year. just went live. I have to figure out where to send you guys to when I'm uh, done here with this game. We will be uh, raiding someone as soon as we're done with this game. So, Alright, let's see. Where are we at? We're 41. So if we hadn't lost that game, we would have been ranked at the end of the year. So we know from now on the fast simit inside the game. So... I think we're going to rock that for UCLA. What happens if I do this? Oh, yeah, I can't go that. But white and black. Let's go all white. Oh, that's that works. Let me look and see what white and white and uh, team color does. All right. There we go. Those are some pretty tight uniforms right there for UCLA. We're going to go with that. And then we'll go all dark blue. I can't change my shoes. It's just black or white. We, we're not going black. Oh, man. So, uh, Jimmy, the uh, Cardinal game is over with. But guess what's on? We got beach volleyball over here. Gotta love beach volleyball uniforms.
I don't remember that movie. I mean, I, I don't remember that one. All right. Averaging 426 yards. Passing. Anybody hurt? Wow, their quarterback is out with broken ribs. Hey, Ropes, I'm not reffing today. It's on TV, too. <laughs> Guess they want to make sure he works on... Uh, he works on his... Uh, timing and everything. Who knows? So we're playing in the Raiders Stadium. That's not too bad. Let's kick it off. <laughs> All right, we're going to stop him. Fumble. Hey, we got the ball. We got the ball. Look at our boys going down the field. Got the ball back. All right, let's watch. We'll actually get in here and do some. What does that mean? I'm watching him on TV. I can watch him on TV. The crazy syrup guy. Hey, welcome in, man. How you doing? Second and five. Second and five. Yeah, when you're working, you're too busy working. Push. Oh, man. God. Ran into his own lineman's back, and then got knocked over. NCA 2002. Welcome back to the Pro. Hey. All right, let's try this fake jet. <clears throat> Boom! Down the middle. He's already stiff arming him. He had his stiff arm out ten yards before he got to the guy. So Laprell, we won the conference championship. We just totally destroyed San Jose State. Uh, we did a fast sim against Boise and lost by 10. Um, so we are in the Las Vegas Bowl against uh, UCLA. So we're probably not going to get ranked for whatever reason. We're going to go 11 and 12 and 2 and not get ranked. But uh, that'll change next year. Try this white corner. Oh, what a strike. Nice. That was a dot and a half. What a throw. And then you found your Atari 20. That's pretty cool. I have a Sega Genesis in the back of our basement somewhere. Push, touchdown, there we go. Commodore 64, I have a uh, cousin who uh, had a Commodore 64 and I used to go over to his house and play late at night and stuff. They, he had a, I think it was a, I think it was a baseball game but it could have been a hockey game. Um, I, would, I would stay up hours playing that game. All right, turn him over. Another touchdown. It's 21 nothing, boys. And they finally scored. It's 21-7. Two-minute drill. 
And we had to punt. Let's see if we can get the ball back. No, and we gave up a touchdown. There we go. Answered back. Two score lead. And they get a field goal. And that's where they lose because that's 11 point difference. Down the field. Touchdown. 17 point lead. And they respond. All right. Fourth quarter with a 10 point lead. Let's get in here and play. They've outgained us yards wise. Wow, that would have been that would have been crazy to have both of them shoot an ace in, in the playoff. <laughs> that would be absolutely crazy. Second and seven. Let's try this middle slant. It's going to be the uh, second guy from the top. That's who he's going to throw it to. There he is. Boom. First down. Every time on that play. Which two golfers? It's uh, Cantlay and uh, DeChambeau. Param Krell, welcome in, man. How you doing? We, uh, we are in season five. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, season five with Northern Colorado Team Builder. And... Uh, we made it to the uh, Las Vegas Bowl. We finally won our conference championship. We got a 90. We took a 63 overall team, and we're up to a 93 overall team now. So, and we've uh, figured out not to uh, fast sim from the menu. We should do it inside the game. Let's do this. This team's pretty good. We've had to kick the field goal. We've had a couple of 60-point games this year, too, in the sim. All right, let's get back in here. We're doing coach mode, so I can actually call plays, but I uh, have no control over gameplay, so let's call this power play and see. Boom, up the field, there we go. Yeah, especially if you want to uh, test how good you are at recruiting and building teams. Yep. So we just come in here and let them run the plays and uh, go from there. That way you can actually see some of the action rather than just spitting out a score, so. Finish this possession off. Boom. Touchdown. All right. We're up 20 with a minute to go, guys. Let's watch a little bit of defense, and we'll be done. We just, we're at 6 hours and 11 minutes right now. So as soon as this is done, um, we'll, uh, we'll end, end our stream because we've been here all damn day. And uh, it's time for me to eat dinner. Wife's already yelled at me once, so. Um, and I'll do all the off-season stuff off-stream, and uh, we'll be back tomorrow morning at 10 Central, so. Hey, Param, are you going to stream right now, or are you just hanging out watching everybody else? Because i got to send all these uh, guys that have been here all day off somewhere else. Not today. Okay, that's cool. Tight spot. You're playing. Jimmy's playing too. Get him. Get him. What a dot. Pick it. Oh! That's why you're a DB, man. That's why you're a DB. Skillet hands. Edward Skillet hands. Let's go. So. 
Hey, Perrin, we did such a good job recruiting the first two years that last season we only had five seniors. <laughs> we cut so much trash that we only had five seniors. And I think this year I only have nine seniors. Yeah. Yeah, we had five seniors and 12 juniors last year. <laughs> so we just replaced everybody, but... That means in two years we're going to have a lot of guys graduating. So I got to uh, I got to go after some of those lower lower overalls in those recruiting classes and replace them. Spread out those classes so it's closer to 15 to 17 each class and not not have those 25 men senior classes. That's not fun. Let's go 26 seconds. Thank you, Jimmy, for the. Thank you, Jimmy, for the uh, gift sub to parent. Appreciate that. We're gonna we're gonna go raid Jimmy as soon as we're done with this game. I haven't seen Jimmy play in forever. It seems like. Now Param has access to those McDonald bags. <laughs> Get those, get those McDonald bag emojis out there. Get them. There we go. Rip it out. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Boom, guys. Twelve and two. So we went three wins, four wins, four wins, six wins, twelve. So we should get our extension. It's the first time I've gotten all the way to the last year of a contract before I got the extension. Let's go. Let's go. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate that. Also appreciate everybody that's been in here all day, coming and going, chatting, biddies, subs, all that good stuff. Appreciate that, guys. I really do. Thank you for uh, hanging out and uh, helping me get my NCAA fix, even though I can't play play. Hopefully in another six weeks, that'll be okay. So our quarterback had 394 and four touchdowns and only one sack. We got our 100 yards rushing. Hayes got his 100 yards. We spread that out. We'll have to look and see if we got any. Oh, what a disappointment. Param, we had 25 pancakes one week and 26 Last week against San Jose State, last no San Diego State, last week we had 26 pancakes. 26. <laughs> Fucking ridiculous. I'm using an air raid playbook that I, uh, it's a custom playbook that I put together. It's ridiculous. Here, well, that updates. We'll go to our, our uh, We'll go in here so you can see what our team is. So this is our quarterback. He was the he was an 80 overall regular scrambling quarterback that we got with 89 speed. And you can see we're set at quarterback for a while. We're kind of set at running back. Receivers were still pretty young. We added a couple. Working on that last tight end to replace the senior. Um, offensive linemen, we're only losing two, but I, I gotta get I got a bunch of juniors, so we gotta we gotta get some good players next year. Got a couple of DNs, so that's fine. We'll probably have to get two more next year because these guys will be seniors. We're solid at D-tackle. We lost two, two here, but we, we added a 78. We added an, um, a 79 for over here. Added a couple corners, so... Yeah, we were 93, 95, 93 this year, so... Pretty good. I don't need to add that. Let me switch cameras before I start talking about shit you guys can't see. I do that all the time. All right, let's save this before we lose power like I did the other day in the middle of the uh, sim. So, all right. Jimmy, we're coming your way, buddy. Let me get over to uh, my dashboard. 
I like streaming. I like uh, rating out of the dashboard because I don't have to worry about getting your name exactly right because it's already in there. So. Anyway, again, I want to thank you guys for uh, coming in here and uh, helping me out, keeping me company, watching my stuff. really appreciate that. I really do. And uh, I'm going to give you a thanks for watching screen, and then we're going to run over to Jimmy's and raid him. And I'll be in there for just a little bit, and then i got to go eat dinner with the wife before she kills me. So thank you again. I really do appreciate it, and uh, I will see you over in Jimmy's.